Hi, Mac. Can I get some yo's? Hello. You here on time today, huh? <laughs> Who is ready for me to beat this today? <laughs> oh wait, I have to double check if my prediction layers are working. I forgot to check earlier. I don't have my um, GBA today. <laughs> I am. Surely. Um, face came on. Nah, let's wait another minute. I'm scared. Why should I be scared though? Yeah, I'm just gonna copy the production layer. Okay, I'm running a test prediction. Don't gambit in it. Oh, now it works. What the hell? Prediction. Oh. Why is it working now? Okay, well that's good. It wasn't working yesterday. Oops, where is it? Copy? Paste! Wait, it's not pasting. It's not- Wait. Oh, you know why it wasn't working on this layers? Because I had it hidden. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Okay, I'm just doing this now, so don't forget later. Because I, I might actually face a gym leader today. Okay, now it's good. Has the GBA wor been working good? Yes, sir. Okay, face came on in 10 seconds for real. My prime still isn't working. Hi, Deacon. Try to refresh your account. Prime is always broken. I swear to God. Am I mobile? You're always on mobile! You know what? That's why. Yeah, I gotta delete the version. I accidentally put my laptop in the washing machine. I'm sorry, but... I think you should get the Darwin Award for the year for 2024. <laughs> oh my god. In the washing machine? How does that happen? Genuinely.
Some of y'all need to go back to school. Um, good morning. Good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. It is March 12th, 11 08 a.m. I'm a little bit late, but that's because I was eating breakfast. I also did my nails right before stream. Only one coat of green. I didn't trim them. They're still really long. I want to, like, claw people in the fun way. But hi, guys. We had Deacon and Mac in the Just Starting Soon screen. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. You thought you ate? <laughs> what does that mean? Hey. You're the dumbass who put their laptop in the washing machine. I don't think you can say anything else. And they can't grill you for it. Or like eating breakfast? Oh. I did have I had chicken. Also, hi Billy, can we get some meals? Okay, before anybody says anything, I have coconut water because it's gonna be a long stream. I have a straw, because I don't like drinking from cups that are like non-water. And then I also have a spoon. So it looks silly. <laughs> but it's because I don't have any big straws, so the straw is too small to like pick up the coconut. So I got a spoon. So you can eat the water like soup? Yes. You know, there's people who do the eating water with chopsticks challenges, and it's crazy. I will never do that. I mean, clippers don't clip it, but it, it would take a lot for me to, like, do a challenge like that. I love doing silly shit, but, like, I can only do silly shit for so long. Okay, I'm just checking my cords of my GBA. I do have it hooked up. It's hooked up today. Um, what else? What else did I do? Also, if... Okay, so... We ended stream at like 6.30 last night, right? So like 9.30 um, Eastern time. And I ate like food right after I ended stream, so like at 7. And I didn't go to sleep until 1 a.m. So... Um, I'm so used to not eating food past 6, that's why. I think it just kept me up. Um, so... If stream goes near 6 p.m. today, I have to eat, so I have food prepped in the fridge. I bought myself, um, cheapy sushi, so I will eat dinner on stream today if stream goes till, like, 5.30, okay? It will, like, watch a YouTube video. Hi, Vicodent! Can we get some yo's? Hello. Mukbang stream? Yes, I just did a ramen mukbang on my YouTube channel. Um, click the link. Nope, wrong link. Click the main channel link. Smile. Okay. What else? What else? And then, this morning, I went shopping. I went shopping. I also, dude, I, cause like, I usually will go shopping midday, cause that's when like, everything is stocked. But I decided to go super early today. My local grocery store didn't have any fish, no cut meats, no chicken. All they had was like, the pre-packaged, like, sausage and shit. There was no meats! So, I didn't buy anything, really. And came home and my sister was like, only one grocery bag? And I was like, yep, they're out of everything. But it's because I went too early. They just didn't have everything, everything stocked. Now I know, like, how all, my, all the customers feel in Supermarket Simulator whenever, like, I don't stock things before that I open the store. <laughs> Three streams in a row? Whoa! I think you should get bonus channel points for that. And you know what you can do with channel points? A lot of things. I couldn't think of anything funny. I'm gonna get on my computer soon? Wait, I thought you put it in the washing machine. <laughs> Guys, it's 11-11. Make a wish. Make a wish. Computer, not laptop? I mean, to me, a computer is a laptop. It's a personal computer. Okay, enough stalling. Guys, should we play the freaking game? So... I went through the VOD, and I wrote down all the po- Oh my god, it's so washed out. I wrote down all the Pokemon I caught yesterday in order. That way, if we get subscriptions, we know which order to kill them. <laughs> it's- It's 1811 for me, and I still wish. Yeah, wait, are you from the EU too? Yeah, that's EU time. Guys, we have so many British viewers. Do I just attract the Brits? Yeah, we have so many UK viewers. I don't get it. I don't stream like that early. It's only two for me. Oh, so you're East Coast. I don't, I'm 
legit don't have like any PSD viewers besides like three of you guys. So I'm looking at my nails, they're cute. It's 7:12? Oh yeah, because the the time skip. Okay. Turn off the music. YouTube. Everybody say hi, YouTube. Dude, whoever has to edit this, which is gonna be me, it's gonna be like a hundred hours of footage. <laughs> Uh, you're in Spain? That's so cool. Okay, everybody say hi, YouTube. Okay. It is day two of the Peace Log 2024. Yesterday, I caught... I caught nine Pokemon, and I got a Mudkip. I got a Mudkip, Poochiana, Wurmple, Lotad, Wingull, Zigzagoon, Ralts, Meryl, Silcoon, and a Shroomish. I ended off in Rustboro City, I believe, so maybe today I get to actually face a gym leader. And even though I caught nine Pokemon, we had two fallen soldiers, Wurmple and Zigzagoon. Chad gifted to make me kill Wurmple. And then, due to my negligence, I killed Zigzagoon. Not snazzy. So, I have my GB booted up again. It's hooked up. And I'm ready to go for day two of this year's Nuzlocke. Wait, that was pretty good. One take Andy. Okay. Am I gonna do the intro first time? Did he actually did? I actually did. The PBA is hooked up. No, it's GBA. Look at it. It's called Game Boy Advance, silly. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> I watched back like the first hour of yesterday's stream and I clipped a good handful of moments. And dude, the GBA bit is so good. <laughs> she neglects her animals. Real, not fake? No! Okay. So before we get started, as you can see, we need three subs to release my next Pokemon. So Oilers, please don't. Please don't. <laughs> please don't. Okay, we can put the music on now. Thank you, guys. The first ever Pokemon I caught was Chikorita. Did you catch it or was it given to you? We determined that yesterday. There's a difference between catching and being gifted. And I fixed my live split timers, as you can see. And look. Wait, I gotta open the game. Okay, how do I start the timer? My splits are green, guys! I'm winning. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing homework? Okay! This is the perfect stream to lurk in. Unless you want to keep making, um, PBA jokes. I'm so glad I'm out of college, guys. It was a struggle. Okay, let's get to work. <laughs> hashtag gifted, hashtag ad. This Chikorita was provided by Raid Shadow Legends. Imagine. Guys, if I do a sponsored stream, will you watch it? Type 1. Okay, so, last night, we ended off in Rustboro City. And my Pokemon were struggling. Right now, my team is... Meryl, Meryl Mudkip, Wingle, Routes, Lotad, and Shroomish. And it's not the best team. So, I looked up some of the gym leaders. I didn't look up what type of Pokemon they had. I only wanted to look at levels. So, apparently, this first gym, their Pokemon are level 10 to, like, 14 or 15. So, that means in order for me to, like, have a chance, I need to get everybody to level 15. So, we'll explore the city for a little bit. We'll explore the city for a little bit, and then, like, we'll go grind some more. I didn't- I thought the first gym would be level 10s, but I was wrong. So let's explore. We're in. This looks like a prison. Or it's a school. Is that a... Is that a dead duck? Oh, that's a person! Okay. <laughs> Devin's Corporation's workers live in this building. Did housing being provided by your employer is really bad? Giat! <laughs> 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 
Skitty is one of my favorites. I loved her in the anime. No, doesn't the sprite look like a duck? Like, it looks like the head and the beak of a duck. It's not just me, right? No, I just have a huge imagination. Um, I don't want to see balls in my chat room. <laughs> I'm kidding, I deleted that one for fun. <laughs> Why are there so many old people here? That's kind of sad. They should be retired and, like, going on cruises and dying on the cruise ship. Mom, Daddy's working at the corporation. My daddy made this, but I can't use it so you can have it. You obtained the Premier Ball. Ooh. Thank you. Gracias. Not my parents currently being on a cruise. Are they 55 plus? No, a crew sounds fun, but then when I saw, like, the actual scary things that happen on cruises, like, I don't want to go on one anymore. Unless I get a million subs, then guys, we'll do a cruise ship stream. Hi, Keelan. Can we get some yos? Hello. Cruises are so much fun. Hi, go Wobo! Can we get some yo's? Okay, okay. Are you like... I know it's like... Okay, should I say this joke? <laughs> I'm not gonna say it. Way back in the old days, Devon was just a teeny tiny company. Okay, I thought you were gonna lore dump, but I guess not. I threw up every day I went on a cruise. My grandma took the whole family on a cruise, and I was like 11. And legit, my favorite part of the cruise was being at the daycare because the other kids were so fun. And I never got to hang out with other kids a lot. I didn't even like the vacation destination. It was to Alaska, which was fine, but it was cold as frig. I, I like legit. My mom and my grandma would be like, Oh, you want to go on this iceberg tour? And I'd be like, No, I want to stay on the ship with the kids. Like, they're so much cooler. I see. In the 15 minutes I was late, you still haven't gone to the gym. My Pokemon aren't strong enough. I can't go to the gym. If I go right now, I will die. And I, you guys don't want to see me have to reset. I will cry on stream. Like, on purpose. Devin's president likes to collect rare stones. Ooh, can I give him this rock? Yeah, I, I, I know. Should I hold her hand? I think the president's son also collects rare stones. Yeah, I'm gonna go grind after I explore a little bit. Oh, it's total? Oh, okay. I guess I can't actually see people's bedrooms. Dude, I just saw my live splits and I got scared. I was like, how am I at six hours already? I thought it was for today. <laughs> The old sailor, Mr. Briny, lives in a cottage by the sea. He goes for walks in the tunnel every so often. The tunnel. Have I dropped the lore how I live in Spain now? I think you said you were moving or something. But that's cool. Do you know Spanish? Yo hablo espanol un poco. Are you like the TikTokers who say, Move to Spain, it's so much cheaper than the US. And then they're like, really privileged. I am Spanish? Oh. Bien. I was deported? <laughs> Sorry, that, I should not laugh at that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Drama. <laughs> Sorry, don't share if you don't want to. <laughs> It's giving cancelled? No! I wasn't actually? 
saved. I just fled the scene. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Okay, no, no self-reporting in the chat room. Don't be confessing to crimes in my chat. Because then the feds will see my stream and I don't want that. A cab. Anyway. That determined expression. That limber way you move. And your well-trained Pokemon. You're obviously a skilled trainer. No, wait. Don't say a word. I can tell just by looking at you. I'm sure that you can put this hidden machine to good use. No need to be modest or shy. Go on. Take it. You obtained the HM01. <laughs> I haven't committed a crime. I just moved here. That's what I tell the fans. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Any Pokemon that's learned cut can... Wait, I missed it. If the trainer has earned the stone badge, shit. Oh, wait, I should be reading this. And unlike a TM, an HM can be used more than once. Ooh. Very nice. When they were expanding the city of Rustboro, my dad helped out. He made his Pokemon use cut to clear the land of trees. Ooh, oh, I need to get the badge first. That's gonna take a while. Um, chat, type one if you're secretly a federal agent. <laughs> oh, who might you be? Your new face around these parts. Have you just transferred into the Pokemon Trainer School? Ooh, I get to go to school? You support deforestation confirmed? Um, that's an Animal Crossing joke. Get new material. Just like I just got my new GBA. Girl, it's the first gym? It's gonna take forever! I'm already at six hours! <clears throat> a Pokemon you get in a trade... Wait, a Pokemon you get in a trade from someone grows fast. But if you don't have certain gym badges, it may not obey you. I don't have any, so... Slay, rebel. You have so many more to go. Yeah. I told you this could take me all month. Wait, what's a GBH? Did I say something bad? Is that like British slang? Oh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I did not say that. I did not. Can we talk about something else, like my actual GBA? Or my GPA? My GPA in high school was a 3.6. Have you taken the Pokemon Gym Challenge? When you get that shiny gym badge in hand, I guess trainers begin to realize what is required of them. <laughs> I can't. Whoa, a castle. Or the White House, if they didn't pressure wash it every day. Hey, those running shoes. They're one of our products. It makes me happy when I see someone using something we made. That's legit why I think product design would be really fun. Like, just seeing people using what you make. It's gotta be such a good feeling. It's a level of- it's a level of accomplishment. I can't talk. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Devon Corporation. We're proud producers of items and machines that enhance your life. What type of machines? Flush. <laughs> I'm sorry. Only authorized people are allowed to enter here. Dang it. I can't test out the machines. This town is huge. I don't want to go in the gym. I'm, I'm scared. Tango miedo. The Devon Corporation? We all just shorten it to Devon. That company makes all sorts of convenient products. 
this was one of those industrial towns where it's just one building and everybody works at the same place. Time-saving tunnel nearing completion is what it says on the sign, but there's also a big X splashed across it in red paint. Uh, just like the Tesla tunnel, right? Such a success. I ain't touching the gym until I'm leveled up. I don't want to, like, get stuck in there. Okay, somebody said a banned comment. <laughs> Ten minutes ago, Deacon said weaklings. <laughs> I'm gonna go and walk the dog. Parentheses, it's me. I'm the dog. You should have put a flirt emoji. <laughs> But bye, Deacon. We'll see you next time. Thank you for hanging out. I keep getting Supermarket Simulator on my For You page and I blame you. I think the feds are listening in on you too, Keelan. Huh? My Pokemon is cute. Sure, I know that. But if you really want, I'm willing to trade it to you. I'll trade you my... Oh. I'll trade you my C dot for my routes if you want. Ooh. You know what you said? C dot is cute? I think routes is cuter, so no. Oh, if you don't want to, that's okay. But my Pokemon is cute, you know. It sucks that I can only catch one of every Pokemon, because I can't catch another routes. Dang. In all sorts of places, there are all sorts of Pokemon and people. I find that fascinating, so I go to all sorts of places. Okay, cool story, man. <laughs> These look like prison buildings. They don't look like homes. Did I talk to you? I don't think I did. No, oh, let me talk to you. I challenged the gym leader, but I'm not gonna... It's not going to be easy winning with my Fire-type Pokemon. Fire-type Pokemon don't match up well against Rock-type Pokemon. <gasps> <laughs> now I know. I primarily have Water Pokemon in my party right now, so... I think I'm going to crush and slay. Pokemon Training School! If I go to this school, will I be able to catch rare Pokemon easily? Uh, no. That's only for pros like me. Did you know this? You can have two on two battle, even if you're not with another trainer. If you catch the eyes of two trainers when you have two or more Pokemon, they'll both challenge you. Okay, that's not fair, though. A 2v1? Don't you think it'd be cool if you could beat two trainers by yourself? Yeah, it'd be, like, cool, but scary. I thought there'd be something behind the tree. Like a ghost or something. Roxanne, the gym leader, really knows a lot about Pokemon. She's really strong, too. The trainer school is excellent. If you study there, you can even become a gym leader. Ooh. I'll just get in easily, because my father's a leader. I'll just follow in his footsteps. Or I will kill my father and take his place. Let's go to school. Oh, wow. There's a lot of kids here. Hello. Didn't we meet before? I think back in Petalburg City. Let me introduce myself. My name's Scott. I've been traveling everywhere in search of understanding trainers. More specifically, I'm looking for Pokemon battle experts. So what brings you to the school? Are you a trainer too? The first thing you should do is to have a Pokemon learn the move Cut. If I remember correctly, someone in this town has Cut. Okay, I'll come back once I do the gym and learn Cut. Pokemon can hold items, but they don't know what to do with man-made items like Potion and Antidote. You gotta tell them to use it. You know what else I gotta tell you guys to follow the channel, because we are... 
30 minutes on the stream, so if you're new here, click the follow button. Turn that heart purple. And if you're already following, turn notifications on. That way you don't miss a single stream. <clears throat> a Pokemon holding a berry will heal itself. There are many kinds of items that Pokemon can hold. Boy, it sure is hard taking notes down. I'm trading Pokemon with my friend right now. I always wanted a C dot, and I'm finally getting one. I don't want a C dot. You know how some Pokemon moves can confuse a Pokemon? A confused Pokemon will sometimes attack itself without meaning to. But once it leaves battle, it'll return to normal. I'm learning so much in the school. Oh. Students who don't study get a little taste of my quick claw. Whether or not you're a good student will be evident from the way you use this item. You obtained the quick claw. Items pocket. Pokemon holding the Quick Claw will occasionally speed up and get to move before its opponent. There are many other items that are meant to be held by Pokemon. Just those alone will give you many topics to study. I almost said when this game was made was Capital Punishment allowed, but Capital Punishment is the death penalty. It's not reprimand. <laughs> it's not getting hit in school. What's it called? <laughs> Those are two different levels of punishment. <laughs> I can't remember what it's called. The blackboard lists status changes that may affect Pokemon in battle. Which topic do you want to read? Um, I think I understand most of this. It's pretty self-explanatory. You just need antidotes. It's called getting smacked? That's also what I did to your mother last night. In the fun way. My goodness, there's so many people here. Wow! You have a Pokemon with you, too! When I get bigger, I'm gonna go places with Pokemon, too! Follow your dreams. Slay. A Pokemon changes shape. If one did that, I would be shocked. If a Pokemon gains experience in battles, it can sometimes change in the way it looks. You mean, like, evolve? <gasps> Is that a Pikachu? Pikachu looks busted. <laughs> Pika. It's Pikachu with an E. For my own Pokemon, I give them perfectly suited nicknames. It's my expression of, uh, originality. Yes, that's it. Oh, he named his Pikachu Pikachu. <laughs> Why give the same Pikachu to a Pikachu? It seems pointless. I suppose it is good to use a name that's easy to understand, but I think your husband is a little bit DOM. Pikachu before his diet? Yeah, isn't it kind of weird seeing like the older episodes? Pikachu was like visibly more plump. Did I talk to this guy? Oh yeah, I did. He's basically saying you're gig you're Giga Chat if you do two on twos. Okay, I think I've explored everything in this city. I'm not going to the gym until I get all my Pokemon to level 15, and that's gonna take a while. So, I'm gonna go shopping. Women be shopping. And then we'll go grind a little bit. My Pokemon evolved! It has a lot of HP now. I should buy some super potions for it instead of ordinary potions. I'm getting an escape rope just in case I get lost in a cave. I just need to use it to get back to the entrance. I'm 
buying some paralyzed heals and antidotes, just in case I run into Shroomish in Pendleburg Woods. I got 2,000 bucks. I'll buy four Pokeballs. <laughs> 50 HP? It's gonna take a while for my Pokemon to get 50 HP. They're $300? Hi, Dio Mio. Yeah, I can't really sell anything. Okay, I'm gonna go see which Pokemon are in the neighboring areas. That way I can catch some new ones, possibly. Route 104. It, okay. How do I find a map? Pokedex. Wasn't there one in your bedroom? Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> you gotta guess. Okay, I will not look up a map. What Route 104 was... I think where Brendan was. It says there's a Taylo. So you know what? We, we're going back. We're gonna get that Taylo. Taylo! Oh, wait. This is Route 104. <laughs> Oopsie. We're gonna find that Taylo. The berries are grown already? That's wild! I didn't realize they'd grow this quickly. Okay, since they're growing quickly... I'm gonna- oh, I only have one Oron Berry. This is kind of like an infinite berry glitch. You plant one, you get two. Let's plant a chesto, because I only have one. back to the route to where I can get a seed on. Because if I got a grind until I get to level 15, I might as well farm a little bit and get that seed on. Because I didn't realize I'd have to level up that much. I thought I would, oh, I would only need level 10, but realistically I'm going to need to be level 15. It's fun watching you experience a Pokemon game for the first time. I agree. Because, just from what I've seen so far, this is a lot more difficult than the newer games. I feel like the newer games, 
I figured they would baby you, but they do baby you a lot. Okay, we watered and planted all our little seeds. Let's find a Talo and a C dot. Those are the... Wait. Route 104. Oh, there's... Okay, there's grass patches behind here. That's the only grass. Okay. So, we'll, we'll farm here until we get a Talo. Quiero un Talo. Grr, Wurmple! Imagine playing this when guides weren't widely available. Didn't they have like those thick ass Pokemon guidebooks you could buy at the book fair? I would get them, or I wouldn't buy them. My mom would never buy it for me. <laughs> But I would beg my friends to let me read their copy and just look at the pictures. So, we're gonna be here for a while, guys. AMA, ask me anything. Dude, I'm gonna have to level everybody up, like, by 10. My goodness. Why did I pick leaf green? Um, green's my favorite color, obviously. And... I just think... Because, like, Emerald has... I almost said Gyarados. It has Rayquaza on the cover. And Rayquaza is, like, so cool. Okay, the Wurple kind of cooked me a little bit. Let's get that Talo. I'm gonna use Defense Girl because I'm already minus 10 HP. Okay, why is he increasing his attack so much? He needs to stop. Do you plan on playing a game from each gen? I mean, if we're gonna do a Nuzlocke every year, it's gonna take a while to get through them all, right? But that's kind of the plan. Like, Pokemon is not gonna be the main meta for this channel. Because I think Pokemon is such a... Like, I don't want to be known as a Pokemon creator. It's very hard to get out of that genre. Oh my god, he did so much damage! Gus, you suck. Oh, wow. Easy. Okay, this is gonna be harder than I thought. Hmm. 
Maybe I should go back and grind for a C-Dot because those Pokemon are lower level. I think I will do that. I'll 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 get a seed off first. Uh oh. I think my new goal is going to be getting every single possible every single possible Pokemon from every single round. That way I don't have to backtrack. I think that's what I should do. And then just naturally with that kind of challenge and outlook, I'll be like more motivated to grind. Because I don't want to grind to grind. It's going to take so long. I mean, I got a routes like randomly, so maybe we'll get a C-Dot quickly as well. But C-Dot... Is it like 1% spawn rate? <laughs> so, we'll see, we'll see. But, let's be honest, I would probably have to like, battle 100 Pokemon to level up adequately, so... I'm fine with that. Just be careful not to overlevel. Bye! I love one hit KOing the gym leaders. It makes me feel so good. I just imagine them freaking out after getting, like, defeated by a child. Is it because of the badges? Wait. Is it bad if you, like, do that? Is my strap bad? I like making things easier for myself. Oh, you mean like the Pokemon, they won't listen to you? Oh, I don't care. Bah. Hi, Goss. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. Yeah, I knew there was a mechanic. They respect you if you have certain badges. Ah. I love a little bit of spunk in my Pokemon. Let him be spunky. I can't wait for your run to end because they won't listen to you in battle. Um, no foreshadowing, please. You know, we can just- This is making it better for the editors, because now they have something to come back to. see if I'm in the right area for the sea dot. Yeah, route 102 is sea dot. I caught everything on 103. 
Um, caught everything in 101. Yeah, so Route 102 is where I need to go for the seed off. I know it's down here, I just wanted to make sure. Oh my god, stop! <laughs> and I'm in! Uh oh. Is Mary already not listening? Uh oh. <laughs> nah, it's not this early. I guess Mary just sucks then. <laughs> Okay, asking for a friend, how long would it take, like, a normal person to beat this game? Dude, not me fist bumping for a level 4 Wurmple kill. <laughs> Dude, level 15 is gonna take forever! I'm saying around 30-ish? <laughs> that means I've used a fifth of my time! <laughs> Holy... 13 hours?! Wait, where, where's 102? I'm lost. Oh, wait, it's back this way. 30 hours for 100%? Okay, now we get a C dot. Streamman's when I get a C dot. Yeah, I'm just doing- I'm playing this for the plot. close to 100% in one game and that was the Eastward DLC. The only thing I didn't do was beat the um the arcade the arcade game, the game within the game. 15 hours would be reasonable. <laughs> Keep in mind, I did lose two of my Pokemon, so I'm like a little bit behind. That's what I'm wondering. I killed one of my stronger Pokemons by accident. And then you guys subbed to make me kill Wurmple. I think I was just so distraught. Stream is gonna get a, a C dot. I said C dot. You should be finishing gym too. <laughs> also, like, it's hard to use the GBA. The buttons are confusing. Oh, I just realized I should bring back sad to the team because they're only level nine it's only four buttons you know some people can't even find the one button and i'm not one of those people i'd grant out the water pokemon is that backseat gaming what the hell you're on thin ice, Mac. Oh, 
By the time you actually fight the gym, all you need to do is sneeze? Yeah, I said I want to get to level 15. I want to sweep. I'm just talking. Cut. Cut. It's super easy. I think you guys are trying to debate me. You guys want me to reset. You guys want me to play for another 30 hours. Okay, Mary sucks. Yeah, but think of the content. I have to prioritize my mental health. I'm starting therapy soon, you know? I don't want to talk to my therapist and be like, Yeah, I think my biggest struggle right now is having to reset my Pokemon run. They would laugh at me. First, they would laugh when they say when they hear that I'm a streamer. And they would laugh even more when they hear that I play Pokemon. Am I even a streamer? Type 1. I do have full-time creator tagged. Which is kind of true. I'm not working, so this is kind of my job. Fuck, I didn't see! Okay, legit, if it didn't make the sound, I would not have noticed. Oh my god. Am I stupid? I, I think I'm just DM. Gus, you're in. Holy moly. I'm like not even looking at the screen. I did the wrong move. I didn't mean to growl. But you know what I did mean to do? Um, run an ad, because guys, we are an hour in the stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad reviewing. Also, if you subscribe today, you can kill my Pokemon. Isn't that wicked? So, get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. I want you to get the badge. I'm gonna be nice. The strat, honestly, for Oilers and Gifters, the strat is... Wait till I get, like, super far into the run... And then you guys can just kill my whole team in one go. Like, if we have any Oilers, like, queuing up five subs, just wait. Just hold. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> no, please, don't! I should not tell you what to do. I don't. Don't listen to me. Dude, imagine... It would... <laughs> it would take me forever to get to the... Imagine having to reset... Oh my god. 10 gifted before the last battle? That wouldn't be enough. Because it's it it grows exponentially. So first Pokemon one sub, second Pokemon two subs. So in order to wipe my whole party, it would take Like right now, right now, it would take three plus four, seven, plus five, twelve. Plus 6, 18. Plus 7, 20. It would take 20. It would take 25. Uh, no, no ideas. No ideas. Please, guys. Hold. Just hold. Just hold. Just hold. Oh, wait. I need to go to the Poker Center. We could just <laughs> dunk your paper boy in water. Don't! I love her! Also, like, I'm, I'm not. Doing the sub incentive to incentivize gifts, because honestly, you guys are too nice to like kill all my Pokemon. It's just like a little extra. Because it's been a while since I've done a sub incentive stream. I've talked about this before, but like, I appreciate subs and gifted, but I feel bad if I don't like react or do something for it. That's why we do calligraphy. 
And that's why sometimes I'll do, like, incentive streams. Also, I will be doing a stream on Saints... Pa I cannot talk. Holy shit. I will be doing a St. Patrick's Day stream, and I may or may not be drinking. Asterisk, not alcohol. Green eggs and ham? Ew. I can't... I can't have ham or eggs anymore. Because most ham is, like, super processed. I could have, like, a honey-baked ham, but that's, like, a lot. And I can't have eggs! I can only have egg whites. Okay, let's get this seed on. Getting the green eggs and ham for school lunch, everybody was torn. You know, it looked gross, but I thought it was delicious. So any kid who didn't want their eggs, I would just gobble it up. Because at my school in, El in elementary, they didn't offer seconds. And I was always so hungry. Okay, I need to get in the habit of switching in Ralph. I need to rearrange my party and change everybody's moveset after this fight because I need to like maximize my finger movements uh, ladies Now I'm good. Oh wait, I gotta change their moves. I wonder who won the Mario Day races? I took a screenshot, and I don't know if it was different heats or not, but only one person got the full 360 points. Which I don't think is right. And I think 6,000-ish people raced. Wait, how do I change the moves? Oh, okay, I did it. Oh, contest move? was contest in this gen. Those are my favorite episodes in the show. Because the Pokemon just looks so pretty. Astonish, Growl, Absorb. Oh yeah, Lotad learned Absorb too. Tackle, ground, mud, slap, water gun. <laughs> Growls cutely to reduce the foe's attack. <laughs> Oh, the 
mudslip does damage too. I didn't realize. Okay, now everybody's optimized. Let's get that seed on. Okay, should I really do level 15 or should I only do level 10? Or I don't think 10 is enough either. Maybe I'll do 13 because it's unlucky. Maybe I'll do 13. Because y'all were saying that 15 is like too OP. I think 13 is a good middle ground. Okay, a crit is worth five. I'll do one more time. Yo! The only, with, the only issue with grinding for the C-Dot is that the Pokemon I'm working don't give me a lot of XP. So it's gonna like... I'm gonna be here a while. Stream ends when I get a C-Dot. It'll, it'll be like zigzagoon all over again, but worse. <gasps> no, no, I can't catch him. I'm so sad. Maybe that's Nazi's reincarnation. Yo! Mary's so strong. Okay, 25 XP, that was more. I think I'm gonna swap out routes, cause... I- I think I'll save routes for whenever I get the... The what you call it. The thing that gives me XP sharing. And I'll put Sad back on the team. Misclicked. God, please. It's because I'm holding the B button to like fast forward, but then I will press A by accident too. Get back to it. Let's get that seed out.
Do you guys want to do a prediction? We can do a prediction. I w I'm gonna be stubborn. I will be in this area until I get a seed out or if I level up. Or get everybody to level 13. So level 13 for C dot first. <laughs> so level 13. And it'll be level 13 for all of my Pokemon. I'll let you guys gamble for five minutes. I will stay here until I get a C dot. I have a 1 in 100 chance. And I'm probably gonna have to battle 100 Pokemon to level up, so it could be the same timing. Guys, go Gamba. I played... I love repetition. I played Let's Build a Zoo for like 4 hours straight one night just to get one breed of animal. I'm not even disappointed when I don't see a seed on. Did you guys do 6969? Oh my god, you guys are so funny. Haha. -ha. I need to be watching Mary's health. Easy. 31 XP? Dude, I don't know what dictates the XP I get. I swear it's random. What, Rattleman? 102. Getting that C dot. Imagine... I run into a sea dot and then I kill it. Oh my goodness. That won't happen, I promise. Easy. So that will give me 30 XP. I swear it's random. Give me that C dot. I know I'm not on the wrong route. It said Route 102 gives me C dots. I wonder if different patches of grass spawn different Pokemon. Because I think the patch of grass by the water gave me a Lotan. For Leaf Green? Wait, am I looking at the right walkthrough? Wait. There's different spawn rates of different versions? Okay, no, this guy is for Pokemon Emerald. I'm fine, I'm fine.
Yeah, it says Sea Dot's encounter rate is 1%. That seed out kind of looks like a worm bowl. No, it doesn't. Go check your eyes. I didn't mean to do crying. I was trying to do like, you know, ee 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 -e, like wiping, but that was the wrong motion. I gotta work on my bits. Mary grew to level 9! Mary's doing pretty good. Let's try down here. I think this is where I got my rounds. Imagine. Even if I were playing on my own, I think I still would be grinding to get a seed on. Because my favorite part about playing any Pokemon game is trying to get as many different types as I could. Like, I would refuse to leave an area until I caught every single Pokemon. It's because I like collecting things. When I was little, I would try to get every single poly park, po every single poly pocket. I was also really into Little's pet shops, but Little's pet shops—I swear they made them for the kids who liked collecting. bunch yeah we had like no joke a crate like like a two by three crate of little's pet shops and then we just gave them all away to our neighbor because i was 10 and i was like i'm done with these so she had so many <laughs> and they were like old little's pet shops too i remember the little's pet shop side of youtube me and my sister Wait, do you guys remember the Barbie that had the, like, the little film camera in it? She and I would film videos on the Barbie, and they were shit. Because we were kids, and also, like, it was on the Barbie camera. But we would film, like, little, little, like, dramas with our little pet shops and our Barbies. My mom kept mine? She still has them? They must be worth millions now. I think I'm gonna find a seed off before I hit level 13 on all my characters. I generally think so. You guys say you want a shiny hunting stream, but it would literally just be this. Just Pokemon encounters the whole time. Aurora hunting stream vibes? Oh yeah, I remember those. They were a pain to edit though. Like going through five hours of Animal Crossing? Holy...
man, that's like OG peace and streams. It's been almost like a year and a half since we've done an Aurora hunting stream. And they're not coming back. Just like Aurora. She's gone. I was a Moshi monster type of kid. I've never heard of that. Is that some British stuff? <laughs> Sorry, that's my straw. I'm almost out of coconut water. Now I can eat the coconut. I'm chewing, sorry. <laughs> The coconut water I buy sometimes has pulp in it. And I like food that has like a lot of texture. And a lot of toppings. Because I love when I'm like overwhelmed with different flavors. If I go get Froyo, I'll get like one of everything. This must be a Wurmple den or something. Okay, I think what I'll try is I'll go to a different grass patch every time I have to go heal at the Pokemon Center. And I'll heal once I get like 15 or less HP. Or once it turns yellow. Uh oh. Kill him! Good job, Mary. You are my goat. I'm gonna do something controversial. I know there's a TM that gives you shared XP. I don't know how far it is in the game. I just wanna look where it is. It's called XP share. Okay, it's in... I have to go to Dufort Town, and then Respiro City. So it'll... I don't know where it is. You're kind of far away, that's what I figured. Okay. Because, like, imagine I grind for, like, two hours, and then I get the XP share, like, in the next town. That's what I was worried about, but... That's not what it looks like. Who's my TM slave gonna be? All of them. I don't usually use the TMs anyway. I like my Pokemons learning things naturally.
And yes, I said Pokemons with an S. I'm a lun I'm a millennial. My goodness, Mary's so strong. You're gonna get to it soon enough, I bet. But I wanna get my seat on. <laughs> I should honestly draw a map as I'm playing. Cause I'm I'm really good with locations, but like names I'm not good at. So like I can remember which way to go. Like up, down, left, right. But the names of places I'm not good with. I hope you use this Pokemon the rest of the game. You now that's something funny. Whenever I play, I usually will make my final party the first few Pokemon that I catch. Cause you know, they've been with me from the start. They're the GOATS! I know it's not realistic to play that way, but I think it's kinda cute to do the final fight with like, the ones who were with you at the start. Mary grew to level 10. Mary learned water gun! Yo. Mary's so strong. Your water gun does 40 damage. Yo. Love that. Mary's so strong! Wait, I should save, huh? I'm going to seven hours. <laughs> Let's test out Mary's water gun. Another Zigzagoon! I think Zigzagoon is like a 20% spawn right here. Water gun. <laughs> Not too shabby. Guys, this is my Meryl only playthrough, where I play with only Meryl for the whole game. I hope you guys enjoy. What if you have a team of just one Pokemon? I feel like that'd also be kind of funny. Because there are trainers that you encounter that have just one Pokemon type. Yo! That was wicked. You know what else is wicked? Sub or not subscribing, following. Because guys, we are 30 another 30 minutes in the stream. So if you're new here, click follow. You get cool emotes and you get to dive in chat. So you don't... Ooh, a Lotad! We haven't seen a Lotad yet today. Yo, finally something new. No more Wurmples. Hi, Alex. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. I just realized 
If I'm gonna be spending a while grinding and leveling up, I should be using the Pokemon that I've caught, like, oldest. But I've caught Meryl three Pokemon ago, so I should be fine. Right? <laughs> What do you mean? Um, because every time we hit a sub goal, I have to release my most recent caught Pokemon. And I'm not saying that for any reason right now, I just thought of it, like, right now. Because my most recently caught Pokemon right now is Shroomish, and Shroomish is my second highest level, he's level 9. That's why I have Shroomish at the bottom. We should release Mary when he hits level 10. No, in order to release Mary, you guys have to release Shroomish, Silcoon, and Meryl. I, I wrote them down in order this morning. So I like, I have to play carefully. And you, you guys can't choose a specific Pokemon to release. That's not fair. <laughs> that ain't fair. Um, VOD watchers, skip an hour, and then surely I'll have a seed out by then. Oh, I thought it was. <laughs> Every time I see Pucci and I get excited. getting there level 10 Mary's getting close to defeating enemies in two hits. My goal is to one hit kill. Just cause like, I wanna feel cool. Two hits. Oh, that was a crit. Never mind. That doesn't count. Ooh, a low dad. A water gun is not gonna work. 
I forgot. Two likes, P. I don't. I don't understand. Okay, can somebody look up like what dictates how much XP you get in a fight? Cause some will get 20, 30, That one was forty-two. No say. Back to it. We're gonna go to a new grass patch. This one down here by the farmer. Mary reached level 11. Two more, then Mary, we can swap her out. Or swap them out. I think I... I think Mary's a boy in the game. <laughs> Another zigzagoon! Oh, Snazzy, come back. Another- They're just taunting me at this point. It took me- I searched for like an hour to find a zigzagoon yesterday. <laughs> and I've seen like four today. Okay, see you soon, Mac. Did my tackle miss? Oh, I zoned out for a second. <laughs> Low dad. Oh, water gun. I'm so dumb. I keep forgetting. Yeah, the last time I fought a low tad, I got 40 XP, so maybe it's the time?
Mary's attack missed. Okay, I took a lot of L's that fight. Yeah, 42 XP for the low tag. Maybe it is the type of Pokemon. I, there's probably like a range? Hmm. Give me more low tags, please. My Meryl is going to be stronger than my Mudkip at this rate. Low dad. A water gun again. Yeah, low tide gave me 42 every time. There's probably a range for the different types. I'm gonna go heal. After this fight. Holy... Thank you for the follow. Plus one. Thank you. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Stream ends when I find the C dot. Hashtag real. Hashtag not clickbait. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Okay, let's check out this tiny patch. Give me a C dot. No, okay. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna be here a while. Okay, theoretically, if it's a 1%, that means if I have 100 interactions, I, I should see a C dot. Allegedly. Supposedly. Unless.
<laughs> I'm looking at the timer. <laughs> Stream as Mario to see dog. It is a higher 20% chance on Ruby? What the hell? That's so stupid. Why'd I pick emerald? Red should have been my favorite color. Really? 20%? Okay, I'll, I'll just switch out the game cartridge in my GBA. I think that'll help. Can I transfer saves? <gasps> Mary grew to level 12. One more level, then we can swap her out. We'll, s we'll swap him out. It's not that I want a C dot, I just want one of every Pokemon. Because imagine if I go into a fight and I lose five Pokemon and I don't have anything else in my arsenal, like in my box, it's game over basically. Because it's so hard to get money, so it's hard to buy heals. I can't believe it's a 19% increase for Ruby. I want to get a Skiddy. That's what I really want. Then I can be just like me in the anime. looks tired after all his fighting. No, Mary's fine. They're doing great. It would be cute if the Pokemon did get tired, though. They're like, please, please let me stop fighting. And they just, like, refuse. They, <laughs> they do a political protest. They're anti-war, no more fighting. <laughs> Okay, if there was a war in Pokemon, they would use Pokemon, right? They wouldn't use machines. I don't know what would be cute about that. I mean, like, cute, like, endearing, not, like, actually, like, cute. Kind of like patronizing, I think is the better word. Like when I say, oh, Chad is so cute for saying blank, I'm patronizing you. Mm-hmm. I'm kidding. <laughs> I would never lie to you guys. Yo, a great? Okay, my theory is correct. Different types of Pokemon will give you different amounts of XP. Because every little town has given me 42. Inching to level 13. 
Low tag. I'm gonna go heal. Okay, the straw is getting in the way. It has been nearly an hour of searching for this coveted sea dog. Do not fret. I will find it. Yeah, up ahead is the last patch of grass. It's been a while since we've seen a Wurmple. serotonin welcome in can we get some yo's thank you for the follow i really appreciate you waiting if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns make sure to tell me welcome in i'm doing good i'm like i'm not upset yet i'm waiting for this c dot watch this okay imagine <laughs> imagine can we get some yo's guys One of these times, I'm gonna say, look at this C dot, and it will be a C dot. Sero? Okay, got it, boss. Mary is so cute. I know, right? Apparently, Meryl is not a good Pokemon to use in game. Because <laughs> the walkthrough I'm looking at, it tells you like what Pokemon are in what area, and then also if it's good or not, and they said you should not get a Meryl. It's like really weak. <laughs> but you know what? Meryl's level 12, and soon to be... Oh, I, I thought she was gonna level up. Or he. One more Pokemon and then we'll switch, probably. Zero gems still? Do you see the graphic over here? No sprites, no gems yet. 
I don't, I don't want to go into a gym and then die! All my other Pokemon are so weak! Because there's no XP share, so I have to, like, battle everyone individually. It sucks. <laughs> well. <laughs> well. I did say this would take all month. Well. Okay, watch this. Mary is gonna level up. Yes, Mary grew to level 13. Finally. Okay, so now let's swap Mary out for a different party leader. We'll still keep her in the team. Or him. You switch. Auto mod? What you said got deleted. I can't even see what you said, Kobobo. Okay, who's my oldest Pokemon? I don't want to level up Ron yet because you guys could kill Shroomish. Let's see. So my oldest Pokemon is Sad. So let's get Sad to level 13. I said baby steps? Oh yeah, baby is a block term. I don't want anybody coming in first time chat. Like, hey baby. <laughs> Ew. Only your mother calls me baby and I haven't seen her in chat yet. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> now, once again... Sad is back on the team, everybody. Okay, attack. They have sand attack. Does that do damage? <laughs> My messages always get deleted during market streams because I keep on talking about the baby characters. <laughs> well, the problem is, if I allow, like, one person to get away with saying a bad word, then it unflags in Automon. And then you guys can say, like, fucking shit. Wait, is that my first swear? I think that's the first time I said the F word today. I really should stop saying that word. Somebody else got automated. <laughs> is Pookie blocked? <laughs> yes. Cause, Cause like Pookie is cute. But you guys can't call me Pookie. <laughs> I curse like a sailor. I used to curse so much. Like, I'm editing old streams, right? And even some of my streams from last year. So, like, early 2023 and late 22. I swore so much. Like, I said the F word almost, like, once a sentence. It was crazy. But I've definitely toned down a lot. Mainly because, like, I edit my streams now. So I'm like, shoot. The more I curse, that's literally more work for me. I'm crying I was testing it? You sh I don't think you should be testing the automata. I can see it. And you know what? You can get in trouble for that. You know who else is in big trouble? You know who else is in big trouble? The non-subs. Because guys, we are two hours in a stream. An hour's worth of CDOT searching. So... If you want to avoid that ad, all you must do is subscribe for $4.99, just $5, skip your coffee, and get ad free viewing all month long. And if you subscribe today, you could possibly kill my Pokemon. Um, please don't subscribe. Okay, get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. <laughs> Checks if Bay is blocked. I'll block it right now. I'll block it. Don't try to test the auto mod. When you say, I'm going to test the auto mod, it sounds like you're, like, testing slurs and stuff, too. Like, stop. I wish there was, like, a counter to see, like, how many auto modded messages a viewer has. Because I can see timeouts, but I can't see, like, a list of all the bad words people have said. Not slurs? How do I know? <laughs> Just pet names? <laughs> Well, now I know what else to ban. What if someone wants to use it when talking to another chatter? I only allegedly know if two people might be dating. I don't know if it's a joke or not, though. Otherwise, don't be flirting with each other. You know, that's what you're supposed to be doing in Minecraft servers, not the peace in underscore 17 chat room. 
Okay, sad is kind of weak. It's not a joke. Yeah, I know it's not a joke. <laughs> They're so cute. Okay, let's go heal sad, because sad is pretty sad and weak. Literal goals? Your, your goal is to find a lover in the chat room? I think that's like... Honestly, a red flag. No, I don't- I don't think I could ever date a streamer. <laughs> no, to find a lover? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 but like, what if- what if you go on a Tinder date on someone, and then you find out that they're a Twitch viewer? Is that a red flag or a green flag? I would have to say, like, a beige flag, because, you know, they would get, like, they would pog when I say pog, but then it'd also be, like, they're also a Twitch viewer. I feel like there's, like, a level of cringe to it, but then, like, it just shows that, like, they care. Because watching a Twitch streamer is so different than watching a, a like, a YouTuber or TikToker. Because when you watch a streamer, you're seeing, like, their real, authentic self, usually. Red flag, but I'm also wearing red tinted glasses. Oh, that's that's actually really good, Keelan. We know the the quote is rose tinted glasses. Actually, that was really bad. You were so close to a good pun. Ooh, 42 XP for a low dad. Okay, okay. Next question. If you find out that your Tinder date also watches Twitch, do you ask who they watch, and then do you admit who you watch? Would you, would you tell your date? <laughs> that you watch peace in underscore 17 and they'd be like who no 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 but like it would be a huge green flag if they said oh my god i love peace in that would be a huge green flag <laughs> absolutely not <laughs> i mean you only watch my channel keelan so like you wouldn't have any other answer what if they go that's my favorite tiktoker that would be really funny i do have more clout on tiktok let's be honest also, hi, Chip. Can we get some yos? Hello. Okay, I might put my hair up soon. It's starting to bug me. Chip's first chat today answering the question? What if Chip was lurking? <laughs> Dude, I cannot believe I named Poochiana sad as a joke, and now they're just sad forever. It's kind of like how I named myself Peason. I have to be kind all the time, when in, like, reality, I'm not. Maybe I'm flirting? Um, mods! <laughs> Months. You guys, we're playing Pokemon. This is like the least, like, how do I say this? Attractive thing. Most Pokemon players are crusty, which I am not crusty. I bathe today and I did do my little toner exfoliation this morning. I'm joking. Chips sweating in their seat. I tried watching another streamer last month, month and it wasn't it. Ooh, big drama. See, like, once you start peace in, you can't go back. Wait. Once you get peace in, you can't get out. Like, in, out. I don't know, you bathe in the morning, yeah. I usually wash up in the morning because, like, I just feel, like, ready for the day. And anytime I bathe in the evening, it throws off my whole cycle. Yeah, I, was, I, w I wasn't gonna say anything about Keelan's emo, but... Um, drama. Wait, isn't one of my chat rules no drama farming? Mods, get Keelan. Get him. 
I don't want any drama in the chat room. Wait, have I given Keelan a timeout? I feel like I have. Wait, Keelan hasn't gotten any timeouts? That can't be real. Keelan hasn't gotten a single timeout? Yeah, Keelan, if you're watching on desktop, if you hover your cursor over an emote, it literally says the channel name. Guys, this is why I can't trust you. No, I'm still surprised I haven't given Keelan a timeout. Like, even jokingly. I've never hovered over emotes? Oh, that's the first thing I do whenever I see an emote I don't know in a Twitch chat. I will hover just to see, like, the channel. Because... How do I say this? No drama, no clippers. But, um... If I see an ugly-ass emote, I assume it's somebody who has, like, no clout. Um, prime example, my channel. But, like, there are some, like, really obscure emotes. That's why, like, I try to keep my emotes, like, react faces, because then you can use it in any context and you can kind of understand. But, like, there- I've seen, like, shoes. I've seen, like, a shelf emote. Like, huh? Like, the whole point of making a Twitch emote is to have it be versatile to where, like, either it's contextual to, like, the conversation within a chat room, or, like, a rando can understand what it's trying to convey. From now, I'm gonna start using tone indicators. <laughs> no, you're fine, Chip. Um, try- if you watch on desktop, Chip, guys, download the 7TV extensions. Because then, if you're joking, just put a little picture emote after the message, and we know you're joking. Like, legit. Okay, I really want Sad to learn a new offensive attack. He's already level 10, and he hasn't really learned anything new yet for a while. Keelan, I think you're fine. Just don't bring more attention to it. <laughs> Like, sometimes I'll get gifted subs to channels that I don't even follow, and it doesn't make me want to follow the channel. That's why, like, the Twitch algorithm for gifted subs will do that. But it doesn't work on me. But if I am a current follower channel and I get a gifted sub, then I will watch more. Mainly because, like, I like using the little pictures. Yo! Sad grew to level 11. Two more. When I get gifted, I never chat and just say thank you. That's also good. Because it shows that you care enough to like... At least thank the order. Did we end up finding the seed on? No. No, we did not. But either way, I still would be grinding, so like it doesn't really matter, right? I wanna get to level 13 for everybody. It is a strat. To gift subs, that way it gets people to start chatting. Like, getting the one interaction to where, like, Oh, thank you for the sub! Like, that does incline people to start chatting more, too. 1% of the time? More like 0% of the time, that's what I'm saying. You beat me to the joke. I feel like the odds are lying to you. I don't know, my uncle does work at Nintendo, so... You know what? I'll have him hack my GBA next time. Maybe he'll get it back to me by tomorrow. When I get gifted in a larger streamer's chat, I just like when I don't have the advantage to say thank you. Hmm. I mean, that's fine. The, the thing with, like, chat vibes is obviously there's a whole different environment when looking at, like, a, a 10 viewer streamer and then a 100 viewer streamer. And then also, like, a thousand-plus viewer streamer. 
It depends on like what you want to gain from the content. Like, do you want one-on-one -on -one interaction or do you want to have a good time? That's why like I hate the criticism of like, man, I okay, I'm not saying this. This is a parody. I hate when like large streamers just ignore the chat and make their own little jokes. I hate it. But then it's also like then that shows that they're entertaining on their own and they don't need to rely on their chat room for like an engaging content. You know what I mean? But then I also understand the user who likes that one-on-one -on -one conversation more so that you see in like a 10 viewer streamer. Which I am not. I average... <laughs> okay, I've been up. I've been averaging 5 this month. I usually average 4. But I don't care. I don't look at my account when I'm live. I just look at like how many chatters I have throughout the stream. Um, what was I saying? So like, you just have to identify like what you enjoy and like not shit on other people's What's the phrase? I almost- I almost said- okay, I'm gonna turn face cam off for this. I almost said shit on other people's cakes, but that- that is not the phrase. Don't yuck other people's yums, that's it. That's the phrase. What is a cake? <laughs> oh. Anyway. Pokemon. Man, I guess Pokemon is gonna be my new Animal Crossing. I'm just gonna yap. If I do get gifted in a larger chat and I'm like in the live when it happens, I usually will at the person who gifted me a sub. Politics? Wait, guys, it is? It is primary day. Make sure you go vote. I voted this morning. I dropped off my ballot box in the morning. Or not the box. I- my envelope. Not- <laughs> Dude, my sister was so funny. Because, <laughs> uh, we had to walk a bit to- to get to our ballot box, right? And... <laughs> my sister, she wore a larger coat. And she's like, give me your ballots. And I'm like, okay. And she like- <laughs> She comically like, stuffs it in her coat. And like, in her like, pant- Scene. Like she had it tucked in her pants. <laughs> Cause she's like, that way nobody can take it. But I'm like, sister, imagine you walk up to the ballot box and there's always like a cop like parked a bit away from this ballot box we go to. Like all the time. Cause it's by a shopping center basically. So I'm like, dude, you walk up to the ballot box, like lift up your pants, that's not gonna work out. <laughs> Oh my god, I was like, they're gonna shoot you on sight, or think that you're stuffing the ballots, because she had mine too. <laughs> but anyway, I, I just held onto my own ballot as we walked, and hoped that nobody, like, mugged me and stole my ballot. I don't know, <laughs> like, I asked her after, I was like, did you do that for the bit? Like, did you tuck it in your pants for a bit? She's like, no, I was being serious. She's like, nobody would, like, try to steal it from my bell loop. <laughs> Dude, she's like, she's- you guys will meet her one day. She, she's faceless and nameless for now, but... She's, like, effortlessly funny. And I think it's because she hangs out with me a lot more now. I made her funny. Um, type 1 if you agree if I'm funny. you guys think I'm funny you click my stream every day mods ban everybody I'm not even kidding <clears throat> yeah I clicked out of my game I mean I dropped my GBA
I was eating. <laughs> You're fine. <laughs> At least I got one one. But for real, I think you're actually funny. Thank you. Should I do stand-up? No, okay, legit, I do want to take an improv class at some point. I think I'd be good. Because... I think I'm good at, like, thinking on the spot. Obviously, not every little bit lands. It's because I think what makes me good at improv... Good. Is that I have anxiety brain. So any single conversation I have... Like, joking, not joking, like, little dialogue boxes pretend show up in my mind of, like, okay, should I say this, this, or this? And then I try to choose either, like, obviously the best thing in the scenario, but, like, for stream, like, the funnier thing. Because before the pandemic restrictions, I was gonna sign up for an improv class, because there was, like, a few in my local area. There's even more in, like... The area I live in now, because I live in a larger city. But then I'm also embarrassed, because, like, I, I have confidence to an extent, and streaming has definitely, like, boosted my confidence a lot. But then I'm also embarrassed. Because when you click go live, it's just me, the camera, my laptop, and I just glance at chat every 10 seconds. And that's the gist of it. But if you're, like, in a class, there's probably, like, 10 to 20 people you gotta, like fail in front of over and over and I don't know if I can take that <clears throat> also like what if somebody makes an anti-woke joke I'd have to call them out for being unwoke and I don't think they'd like that No dad. Yeah, tough crowd. I mean, I think if somebody is taking improv class, they're probably gonna be like a theater kid. When like somebody who's taking stand-up classes would be like a racist person. So I think an improv class is more my vibe. No legit. I've gone to uh my local stand-up bar a few times. It's the next town over, so it takes me a bit to get there. But I try to go every week a different day to, like, check out the different local comics. And I swear... I've... Okay. I've gone three nights the past few weeks. I've only seen... Like, three... Woman comics. Only, like, two queer comics who made jokes about being gay and those were funny. <laughs> but then everybody else is like, Oh my god, I fucked this chick last night. Or... Man, woman, am I right? <laughs> like, one, okay, one guy's little bit was about how he bought the wrong beans at the store for his girlfriend, and then his girlfriend got mad at him. And it was reminding me of, like, these other, like, TikToks I've seen where it's like, if your boyfriend or husband does this, break up with him. <laughs> and, like, the anecdote of, like, buying the wrong thing at the store was, like, one of the break up with him points. Also, sad grew to level 12. Let's go. One more, then we can switch them out. Straight guy jokes? Yeah, it's like... And they're all like crusty-ass, balding white men. And I swear, everyone will, ev all of them will say, you know, my wife is letting me do this to like get out of the house. It's like, I have no other passions in life besides like making really underlyingly sexist jokes, but you know, it's what I love doing. <laughs> And they all, they all sound like this. 
like, how do I say this? <laughs> okay, I am one to talk, but not many of them are like attractive. Like, there's no like, there's no like nine out of ten person on stage. I've only seen like one super attractive guy. But he was twenty, so like you know, this that's in my age range, so like I'm okay to say that. Like, I'm obviously not a 9 out of 10. I'm a 10 out of 10. <laughs> and, like, there's a few local bookstores that host, like, Poetry Slam. But then I feel like that'd be... I don't know. I don't know if I'd enjoy that. Oh, there was this also this one comic. It, I feel really bad whenever I go because I always remember like the really bad jokes they make, like the anti woke jokes. Like there was this one guy who he was like making jokes about like the homeless. Or unhoused, he's like, you know, we have to call him unhoused now. And da 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 da. And it's like, okay, dude, like, what's the joke? And he went on and on about like how much like homeless people deserve what their living circumstances. And then like he didn't get booed off the stage, but like he hit his five minute mark. And like he grabs the mic and then he like yells into the mic. He's like, the homeless are not human. I have to say it. And then he walks off stage. And it's like Whoa, who hurt you, man? Like, shit. Yeah, it was crazy. I was like, holy fuck. Wait, I swore. It's, it, talking about the homeless and unhoused, what a lot of people don't understand is that it's so easy to fall into poverty or homelessness. Like, you get laid off, you get fired, you're cooked. It's so hard to find a job on your own without nepotism. It's more it's more difficult if you don't have like training or education it's harder if you are poc even like your name can be used as discrimination right so and also like if you don't have a social safety net like family or friends you probably won't have somewhere to go if you fall upon hard times like not i don't think there are very many people who choose to live on the streets and then another counter is that um, homeless shelters aren't homes. They're not permanent living establishments. People usually are only allowed to stay during night. So you have to like get all your things and go in the morning. Like yeah, they offer showers, a bed, but it's not like a consistent place to stay usually. And there's a lot of like bad shit that happens in homeless shelters. Like SA, your shit can be stolen. Some don't allow pets. And sometimes if all you have is what's on your back and your pet, it's like, why risk losing that, you know? So, I can understand why people may feel unsafe or scared of unhoused people in particular. Because any stranger is scary, of course. But still, like, be compassionate. Advocate for policies. Oops! <laughs> no more PP <pee> left! <laughs> um, um. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god, Sans almost dead too. Uh oh. Um, I, I need to swap my Pokemon. <laughs> anyway. Always advocate for policies that will do housing first. Advocate for more social safety nets. Um, socialism, we love her. And advocate for long term housing. Like, there's empty buildings, there's empty hotels. Renovate them to permanent shelters. Did you catch the sea dot? No. Oh, I didn't mean to switch Pokemon. Die. Okay, I almost let Sad die. That could have been very bad. I was- I was too busy yapping. <clears throat> also, 
Going back to what Chip said during my little rant. Um, Chip, Chip in chat said, Some people don't understand comedy and using people as a punchline is a red flag. I think... No clippers. I think it's fine to, like, make jokes about people. Only if you have that lived experience. Because theoretically, if you have that experience, you can empathize and understand, like, what's okay and not okay to say. And then, hopefully, somebody will also giggle at your little joke, because if you do jokes that are related to, like, identity, like, your race, gender, um, right, what else is there? I think those are the main ones. Um, obviously, if you live it, you kind of understand, like I said, what is funny and what is not funny. And then also, you have to learn how to, like, properly resonate. Resonate meaning connect. Also, I think resonating quickly, but also deeply. Okay, we're gonna grind here a little bit. Surely I'll find a C-Dot. Yeah, I get what you're saying, Chip, but I think it's important to, like... There's obviously nuance when it comes to commentary or comedy. Like, you don't- I don't think it's appropriate to say, like, you can't make jokes about this type of group at all. Because then... I feel like... That just won't be good either. Like, people don't like when you're, like, vocally advocating for, like, things that could be seen as censorship. So I think it's fine to joke if you have the lived experience. Oh, another point. Because, like, when you make jokes about identity, so gender, race, you're literally potentially insulting, like, that whole person's how they see themselves, their little humanity. So even more so, like, don't try to tackle those subjects if you don't understand it. I joke about Hispanic people. Correction, I'm Hispanic. Man, if you didn't correct that, you'd be cancelled. Mods get mech. Another thing I need to remember whenever I do go to like those open mic nights is that these are people that are you're just giving a mic to. Like they're not professional, they're not like actual writers typically, they don't have any formal training. So like you gotta give them a little bit of grace. Like when that one bozo called me sick for being disabled, maybe you shouldn't have said that shit, but you know. Maybe he just doesn't know how to, like, improv well. Um, for context... Wait, I told that story during a sub-only, so some of you guys don't know the story. I'll tell it now. Um, sub-only exclusive being leaked on the Peace and Stream. I want- This is my first time ever going to my local open mic night. And the guy who was hosting, he was, like, roasting the crowd. Um, I'll give, like, the TLDR. I'll do the quick story. So, like, he was, like, making fun of some of the crowd members. There was this one girl who had, like, a pleated skirt. He was like, oh my god, you look a like a cheerleader. And she's like, yeah, I do. And there was this one, like, butch-looking lady. Butch. She was lesbian, it turned out. So, like, I could say that. Um, I do have LGBTQ tagged. I'm fine. She looked like a butch. <laughs> And he was like, oh, you look like a lesbian. And she's like, yeah, I divorced my wife last year. <laughs> or the wife divorced her. I wasn't really paying attention. But anyway. And then he, like, looks around the room. Keep in mind, there was only, like, ten people in the audience. It was a slow night for them. My first time there. So if I wasn't there, it would have been not. So he looks around the crowd. I wear a mask when I'm in public because I'm disabled and also, like, um, class solidarity. And the pandemic's not over. A lot of people still die every day. So, wear a mask. Smile. So, I'm the only person in this club slash bar wearing a mask. He looks at me. He's like, and we got one person still wearing a mask. And he, okay, he doesn't sound like that. <laughs> and he was like, why are you wearing one? Are you sick or something? And I'm like, 
And I try to say this loud enough for, like, the people in the crowd. And I'm like, I yell, I'm disabled! Which is true. I have uh, multiple conditions. Smile. And then... And then he says, he pauses for, like, two beats. Which is, like, four seconds. I To me, a beat is two seconds. And then he's like... Oh, yeah. Wait, so first he said, that means, are you sick? He asked me, and then I said, I'm disabled. And then... And then he said... What did he say? Oh, wait, he said, well, that still means you're kind of sick, though, right? And, like, I didn't do that face, but, like, I'm gonna- I went like this, I put my arms out in front of me like this, I hit the mic, I'm sorry. So it's like, Bozo, what the hell? Like, I didn't say anything? Like, I- I circled through, like, five different things I could have said, like, back to him to, like, make him feel really fucking bad. But I was like, I'm gonna be nice, I'm gonna be mature, I'm not gonna say anything, because, like, this is, like, his opening set. Like, I'm not gonna ruin the whole vibes of the club, because, like, if I say something back, like, then I'm the bitch, right? Um, so I didn't say anything, and then he said, um, well, I guess we're all kind of, like, mentally sick in the head, right? And then he moves on. And it's like, hmm. Anyway, so that, that was what happened, and if you don't understand why that was, like, not chill, like, disabled people are not sick, like, you, you don't say that shit, because, um, disability implies that it's, like, semi-permanent or long-term. And sick is usually, um, temporary or contagious. So, like, if you call disabled people sick, then it's just gonna lead to more ostracization and, like, more exclusion from public settings. Like, after he said that shit, I was like, I'm not gonna come back here again. And, like, also this club, it's not, like, ADA, like, accessible either. Like, if somebody had a wheelchair or a mobility scooter, they would not be able to get in that building. So, even more so. Whack joke, yeah. So, anyway, where was I going with that? So, okay. Like, I'm almost- I'm also, like, not visibly disabled either. Like, I bet if I, like, had a walking aid, like a cane or a walker, he would not have said that shit, right? But I don't look physically disabled. Anyway, where was I going with this? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, because he said this bozo might not be good at writing, so I can't be, like, too harsh about it. Yeah, so, like... Obviously, like, the open mics that I go to in my local area, like, they're not huge clubs. They're, like, the guy who works at the factory during the day. And goes to open mic to, like, not beat his wife. Can you not be sick for an extended period of time? Well, like I said, sick implies temperance. Like, something that's temporary. But he, well, going back to the main point, don't call disabled people sick. That's not chill. Like, he should have just said, Okay, I'll leave you alone, shall we? And then moved on. Like, him saying... Him alluding that I'm still sick because I'm disabled is kind of like, Ew! And then him also saying, Well, everybody's mentally ill and sick anyways, also minimizing me further. So it's like, Ew! Hit me with the one and two. But like, it's fine, it's whatever. I'm over it. I am I haven't thought about that for like, because that happened. Oh, that happened a month ago at this point. And I haven't thought about it for like three weeks. No, two weeks. It fucked me up for like two weeks. That's what I mean. People who can make those types of jokes are whack. I think they just either don't understand like. I, I just think they don't understand, like, they aren't able to empathize to a certain level. And that's fine, because you can always work on your empathy. That's something you can, like, train yourself on. <laughs> oh my god, wait, Sad is probably gonna level up here. And, like, empathy comes with time and maturity, so... Like, if some little Zoomer said that shit to me, I'd be like, okay, whatever. But, like, this guy looked like he was 30, so I was like, he should be a bit more empathetic at this point. But, it's whatever. It's in the past. When I get famous, I'll cancel him. I'll do it. For the fans. Come on, level up. Oh, 
full sliver! Come on! One more fight. I almost threw my GBA, I got so mad. This will be the seed op? Surely. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, can we talk about something fun? I don't want to, like, trauma dump anymore. I did trauma dump a lot during my Animal Crossing streams. It's not because I'm, like, sad. It's just, like, when I don't talk, I think. And then when I think, I get existential, and then I get sad. That could just be the Espresso Depresso, though. Anyway, sad is gonna level up right now. Yes, sir! Level 13! Let's freaking go. Zero attack? What the hell? <gasps> Sadler bite! I was gonna make a joke, but like... Anyway. <laughs> Sad about to be put in a muzzle? Oh, 60 attack? And it causes flinching? Holy! <laughs> I love Minecraft. <laughs> so you know what I was thinking, but I was like, let's not, let's not talk about drama. Or, actually, it's not drama, it's called crime. Anyway. Okay. I pressed escape. Uh, uh, I pressed escape on my GBA, obviously. Okay, now that Sad is level 13, let's switch for my oldest- my next oldest Pokémon, which is Lotad. Yes, I do have a clipboard. I'm keeping track of everything. Lotad. Lolly. <laughs> I- <laughs> I legit- I forgot what Lolly meant when I named my low tad Lolly. Mods. Wait, is Lolly a blocked word? <laughs> it's okay, it's like Lollipop. That's what I was thinking. I wasn't thinking of anime. Or. Or. Prominent creator. Okay, when I say no drama farming for chat, I have to remember that for myself. It's cool how you, how you have a list and a GBA. Of course, I would never emulate. This is my authentic GBA that I bought last week. I rested them twice. <laughs> Okay, surely I will get a C dot. And you know what else I'll get? New followers, because guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click the follow button. If you knew wait. I already said that. Turn that heart purple. And if you're already following, make sure notifications are turned on that we don't miss a single stream. Smile. I thought you said you found it in your garage? Yep, I found it in my garage. And then I sold it, and then I bought it back. Low dad. Dude, what happens if I can't find a sea dot? Okay, I genuinely- Okay, the prediction is for getting all my Pokemon to level 13. It's looking like I might get everybody leveled up first. Literally bought it from the garage, what do you mean? No, I I found it in my garage and then I sold it because I didn't know what it was. And then I was like, oh my god, I'm going to play Pokemon. And then I bought it back. You know what? You know how I know it's mine? 
You know? Wait, wait, wait. You wanna know how I know it's mine? It has my initials on it, see? See? P.I. Peason. It's mine. Oh, Astonish isn't gonna work on Pucciana. Uh-oh. Um... Oh, this is really bad. I might not be able to level up Lolly. Yeah, the only thing I can do is absorb. It's fine if I don't gain health back. I just need to drain Pucciana. And not in the fun way. What are my pronouns again? She, her. Smile. Yeah, I do have a command. I forgot. I haven't used that in so long. Yeah. See, I don't even know half the commands. I made all these commands when I was like a zero viewer streamer. Because I was like, you know, I want to be ready. If I get a million viewers, I want to be ready. I'm going to have every single command that's in the book. And then I, I forgot all of them. I don't even know my raid command. I never get raids. <laughs> that's also because I don't collab. And I'm also like at the bottom of the discover tab because I have such low viewers. But that's fine. I don't care. Oh, well, a stomp's might work. Yes, sir. Okay, absorb does not work on grass type. Loli is not good for this area. You might be here for a while. Talking about pronouns, because I want to be woke. I do have a rainbow emoji in my title and LGBTQ tag. Guys, level 8. Let's go. I remember. This was... Was it? This was a year... No, this had to be two years ago. My mom, she works for the school di district where she lives. And she worked there for years. And she got an email at the start of the year. And the person who sent the email in their little... Like, you know how you put like a little sign-off signature at the bottom of your email? She was like, why does this person have their pronouns in their email signature? It's so weird. Can you explain that to me, Peason? Because, like... Okay. For context, I'm bisexual, okay? Pog. When I told my mom... Because <laughs> this is a side story. We'll go back to the main story in a second. When, when I told my mom, she was like... Because she was asking me, like, why do you so know so much about, like... Like, gay stuff. <laughs> like, policy and stuff. And I was like, well... I nervously said, I was like, well, mom, I'm, I'm technically bisexual. And she's like... She paused for a little bit, because, like, I knew she likes gay people, because we had, we had a lesbian couple. And they were they're really cute and sweet. Um, so, like, my mom, like, interacted with that couple. And she had a few co-workers who were, like, lesbian, too. So, like, she's chill. So, like, I, I didn't feel, like, scared to come out to her. This was, like, three years ago at this point. Um, and th the first thing she asks me when I told her I was bi, she was like, So, do you have threesomes? And I was like, Mom! I was, <laughs> I was like, you can't say that shit! <laughs> and then she also asked me, like, have I ever cheated? Which is, like, also, like, not cool. That's not chill. <laughs> and so, so I had to explain to her, like, why it's not... 
It's not chill to like ask if a bi person has threesomes. <laughs> she held no punches. Yeah, oh my god. It was crazy. Anyway, I don't talk to her anymore for other reasons. Anyway. I've been no contact for a year and like my mental health. Yeah, mental health up. Up. It's on the up and up. Just like my peace and stocks. Guys, subscribe today. Invest now. Anyway, going back to the main story, so she was like, Peace, and why does this person have their pronouns in their email signature? And I was like, well... Okay, this was after I came out to her, so like, she knows that I'm queer. But she doesn't- she doesn't- she knows about like, the gays, but not about like, um, uh, like, NBs or trans people as much. Like, she still thinks they're kind of weird. I'm using her words. We love everybody here. Um... So she was like, why are they putting their pronouns in their email signature? And she's like, they're telling me that I have to too. Why do I have to? I look like a woman. And I was like, um, and like, my mom, she doesn't look that feminine. Like, she looks like every other single, normie, Karen cut looking ass. And also, she's really tall. She, how do I say this nicely? Um... How do I- okay, how do I say this nicely? She- she's very, like, flat-chested. Like, she's flatter than me, and I'm pretty flat. Anyway. So, like, she doesn't look traditionally feminine. So, anyway. Yeah, she- she kind of looks, like, like, bushy. Anyway, I haven't talked to her in a year. For other reasons. <laughs> and I was like, Mom, well, you understand that, like, it's, like, kind of- the norm to like assume what someone's pronouns are and she's like yeah and i'm like well that's kind of not the norm anymore i was like you know we we live in a state i live in washington state like the most fucking lib state ever i was like you know we live in washington so like obviously people are gonna be like more open to like expressing who they are truly and she's like okay but like why do i have to pronounce in my signature I was like, well, it's kind of like when you introduce somebody with your name, you're kind of like immediately opening up and being kind to this person and be like, I want to be called this when I talk with you. So kind of like if you open with your preferred pronouns, then the person that you're meeting for the first time knows how to interact with you. And if you take the first step and say your pronouns first, then... That other person might be more open to say the pronouns they truly feel more comfortable with. And she was like, okay, I get it. It's still kind of weird. But why do I have to put it in the email? And we just kept going in circles. And then she um, didn't put them in her email. Her signature. But you know what? At least she was like willing to listen and like try to comprehend it a little bit. Because my stance is, I think people can do whatever you want as long as you're not hurting anybody or yourself. And I think what a lot of people don't understand when it comes to like gender identity is that, like, you can't just get surgery. Like, they're not doing surgery on minors either, that's just propaganda. And in order to get like any type of hormone or surgery, you have to be evaluated by a medical professional. Like, you can't just go to Walmart and get your, like, estrogen. You can't do that. Yeah, there's no free surgery coupons in the paper either. Like, you have to be professionally evaluated, you have to be diagnosed, and even then it takes a long-ass time for some people. And there's a lot of barriers to get that medical care. And just because you don't understand something doesn't mean you shouldn't be empathetic, you shouldn't try to listen. Because everybody has their own struggle, and you choosing to not listen is just minimizing that other person even further. Getting people to listen is honestly the hardest stuff sometimes. Oh, for sure. But in order to get people to listen, you have to humanize. And then also... Um, um, humanize. And then... I don't- there's no word for it, but like, you have to find, like, a common ground. 
like, I, when I was explaining to my mom about, like, using pronouns and shit, I was like, well, you have, like, short hair. You're kind of tall. You don't necessarily wear skirts and dresses all the time. I was like, people not, might not be able to assume your pronouns if they didn't know you. And she's like, what do you mean? <laughs> but y you have to humanize and then also find a common ground. That way they can empathize a bit easier. Like, I think you have to find, like, a common struggle, I guess. Even if it's not the same struggle, it has to be similar enough to where they can empathize a little bit. If you want to change subjects, I got you. Um, change. Give me a new topic card on our date. I'm kidding, it's not a date. Like, okay, I was thinking that was not a good joke. Erase it for the VOD. Like, you know how they'll have those, um, card games where it's, like, truth or dare, and you do it on, like, your, like, your third date? I was thinking of that joke, but... That's not what I wanted to say. Ever played Fire Emblem? My sister just asked me that the other day. Like, she legit- she- <laughs> Cause she was watching me play, um, Unicorn Overload, which I haven't touched in a week since it's come out. I will play it. Not on stream, but like, in my own time. I've just been editing so much. I haven't had much time to like, play games. Besides, on stream with chat. So, my sister was like, Do you wanna play Fire Emblem? And I was like, why? Because she was like, it's also an anime game just like this. And I was like, why? <laughs> and she's like, it looks like it has good lore. And I was like, no, I'm not playing some weeb game. I know we're Japanese, but I ain't playing no weeb shit. How many channel points do you guys have? I have 22k. I wish that was my income amount. I think the most cheddar I had in the bank was um when i when i quit my job i had like 13,000 but i think the most i've ever had at one point was like 20,000 but that was in a combination between savings but there was one there was one time where i paid off like $2,000 worth of my student loans in one sitting like i was feeling like a baller but now wait did i make did i get my twitch payout wait <laughs> i i'll probably get my twitch payout like Wait, let me actually check. <laughs> I might have more money than I thought I did. Um, last time I, last time I checked, I had like $45 in my checking. Guys, can we get some subs? Wait, did I get my Twitch mail? It'll be today or tomorrow. Nope, I did not get my Twitch bill yet. I'm still at $45. Let's freaking go. Anyway, back to Pokemon. Guys, I'm broke. Um, shout out to my sister who's been supporting me the past year. Smile. Guys, you have to promise, whenever she does a faceless Valor stream, you have to watch. You know, she supports me, you support her. No, I asked her. Because, like, she's kind of interested in what I do. Like, because she loves YouTube, like, so much. So she's more into, like, my YouTube analytics. Um, guys, click subscribe, sub to the YouTube, weekly videos. So she's, like, more interested in, like, my YouTube analytics. Because she's like, okay, I like that thumbnail, or that one could be better. But, she, like, she's kind of not as interested in the stream stuff I do. But that's because, like, stream is all about commentary. She doesn't like talking. Which is valid. And she said, I might want to film at some point. And I was like, that'd be cool. But I was like, if you ever film, sister, like, do a VTuber. Like, don't put your face on the stream until, like, you really want to. Like, just do a VTuber. Because, like, if I could go back, I'd be a VTuber. It'd be so much easier. Anyway. Lolly grew to level 9. Let's freaking go. Not gonna lie. When I did that one PNG tuber stream... Like, it was sub only. I used my peace and kappa emote for the PNG tuber. That was genuinely like some of the most fun I had in a long time. Which is like weird to say, but it's true. <laughs> I don't think absorb is gonna work. No! Oh, wait, that was me doing absorb. Whoa, that did a lot. Like, it was really fun because. Whenever I am on camera, I do feel like this slight pressure to like react, like do a. You know, faces. 
And, like, I understand that, like, that's part of the entertainment. Like, if I just was like this, like, not moving my face at all, then visually it wouldn't be as interesting. But, like, when I was... <laughs> when I did the PNG Tuber stream, like, I was giggling so much. I was having so much fun. I was actually gaming because I didn't have, like, the added stress of, like, thinking about what I look like on camera. I know my angle isn't the best. You can see my little double chin, but I don't, I don't care. Like, no matter what angle you see me, I'm gonna have a double chin, so I don't care. Um, but using the model was pretty nice. I'm not gonna do that all the time. It'll only be sometimes. It's not often that I don't feel like being on camera because... I always tell myself, if I don't want to stream, I'm not going to stream. Because that just leads to, like, worse commentary. Less jokes. Less yapping. But I feel... I said this last week, but, like, I feel so much more excited to stream now. I think it's because I've been putting more time into editing. So, like, for the weekly stream highlights, and then I'm also working on getting videos ready for the gaming channel. Um, it's not really public yet. You can find the YouTube channel. It's Peace in 17 Gaming. No subs. Let's go. I do want to channel artists by summertime, though. So if you have any artists in chat, um... Tell me. <laughs> I do want to thumbnail artists at some point this year. Because hopefully I'll have money by summer. Smile. Um... So, like, I've been putting a lot more time into editing. So, therefore, I'm thinking about, like... When I'm actually streaming, I'm like, okay, what would be a good bit? What would be a good joke? What would be, like, a good thing to actually keep in a final edit? That's why, like, I've been goofing and gaffing more. Because I'm like, if I do five jokes, maybe three will hit. So then that means three can go in a video. And then that's good. And then I'm also like... <laughs> I've noticed that, like, since I'm using this more, like, YouTube-focused approach, I find that I'm having a lot more fun on stream. It, there is a point where it does feel a bit fake, but there is always going to be, like, a level of, like, acting or fakeness with any type of content. Because no way, like, a normal person is super extra all the time. Like, if you are your authentic self when you're on camera, then that's gonna lead to more problems later on. Like, you're gonna have issues with, like, imposter syndrome, you're gonna have issues with, like, who are you really, like, separating yourself from, like, your actual personality and then on camera. So, like, the the stream personality I have is, like, peace in, but, like, at level 110. And I think Squeaks was talking about this... No, wait, no. I think it was Ludwig talking about it in his stream yesterday. During his members-only stream that I watched. Um... He was talking about, like, how some larger creators, like, actual voices and inflection have changed. Like, talking with them, like, like watching the videos and then, like, also talking with them offline. Like, some of my stream personality does bleed into my IRL personality. But my stream personality is still exaggerated. Like, kind of a lot. Like, 10% more, which is a lot. Like, I will go back and edit or make clips from streams, and I'm like, man, that piece is so funny. <laughs> it's also good because, like, I, I try to keep my real name hidden. Like, obviously, my name is not Peason. Also, don't go looking for my name, bozos. So, I feel like I have a good separation between me, IRL, and then, you know, um, Peason. Wait, you're not Peason? I'm sorry to break the news. I'm not Peason. And you know what else I'm sorry and not sorry about? Running an ad. Because, guys, we are three hours in the stream. Holy an elite group of chatters know it? Yeah, if you watched my stream for the first year and a half, you know it. Or if you go back and watch my VOD channel and watch every single stream. I know, but I'm not saying nothing. If you, I think my name is literally a block term. So if you leak, you're dead. I will ban you. I'm not even kidding. Grr. Also, um, subscribe. If you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. Please don't. <laughs> okay, get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. 
It's also really annoying. Because in some of my old VODs, like, you guys will call me by my name. And that's fine, because, like, my name was public back in the day. But then it's like, I can't edit it out of the streams! Like... I can't remove it from my Vaughn channel because it's already out there. So it's like, I just have to kind of keep it as hush-hush as I can. And like, it's fine if it gets leaked, but it's like, I'd, I'd rather you guys call me Peace. I remember that? Yeah. Like, it's, it's in my older streams and it's, it's kind of annoying to look back on, but... You know what? I made the decision in the past to call, have you guys call, call me by my name, but... Uh, no more. And I have to own up to that mistake. That's why, like, if anybody ever starts streaming or TikTok, don't ever put your real name out there. Uh, just don't. Also, don't link your contacts with your social media. Like, you know what says? Link your Facebook to your Instagram. Or, do you want to add your contacts on your TikTok so you can follow your friends? Click no. Because then that means anybody who has your phone number or your email could possibly too. Um, can find your account. So, like, that's how employers find your social media. I go by Chip, and that's not my real name. I figured, because, like, Chip sounds like a 1920s name. So I was like, your parents are either really old, or it's a pseudonym. And keep going by pseudonyms, guys. You don't know who's out there. Sorry, I'm grabbing more water. I forgot to announce. I wasn't leaving to get milk. No one will ever guess my name. <laughs> you know what? What if I've been lying this whole time and what I said my name wasn't my name? The biggest debate of all time. Yeah, I'm gonna clean my glasses. People are still in an ad, so. We can stall. Ultimate play? What if it is? What if I'm like a mega mind? My brain is really big. Oh my god. Remember the big brain joke era? That was a year ago. I'm gonna have to go to the doctors again soon. Because I have to get MRIs every year. And they haven't scheduled them yet. I just allow my name in here. Yeah. Your name is Mac, of course. Should I put my hair up? I'll keep it down for another hour. I'll try. Oh god, I turned on light mode? Why'd you do that to yourself? Okay, let's play the fucking- freaking. Let's play the game. Okay, I feel like I've yapped a lot. Definitely laughed- Definitely yapped more than yesterday. I'm not even gonna read your message, Mac. You know the answer. You're just saying that so you can farm some peace I2Ls in chat, and I don't appreciate that. Lolly grew to level 10. Okay, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Okay, I'm probably. <laughs> I was joking about getting my whole team to level 13, but like, legit, that'll probably happen before you find freaking CDOT. It's been how long? Two hours? <laughs> Two hours since I've been grinding for CDOT. You're gonna find a shiny before a CDOT at this rate? Okay, actually, what is the rate for uh, shinies? What? Astonish did so much damage! What? Holy... One out of 8,192. What the hell? That's crazy. Okay, what should I do if I get a shiny? A shiny. What should I do if I get a shiny? Should I, like, pog out of my mind? Should I jump out of my seat? What should I do? What would be a good reaction?
You should rip the GVA? No! I can't rip it. It's obviously plastic, see? Wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. How would I do that bit? <laughs> wait, I need to workshop this a little bit. This, this is wood. <laughs> I was knocking on wood for good luck. The only plastic thing I have is my GBA. If you did find a shiny, you'd probably murk it with how powerful your team is. No. It'd be fine. I would just tell them to not hit. Would you catch it if you had the same species already? Yes. If I have... Yes. If I see any shiny, I'm allowed to catch it. For the glory. But, okay. Also, if I get a shiny, please don't kill it. Oilers, please. What if it's a shiny see it on? Ain't the way! I, I'm just practicing for later. No way! Okay, we're going to a different grass patch. I keep forgetting. Yeah, I gotta practice my reactions. It's kind of like how I practice my stream lab. <laughs> I do that for like five minutes before I click a live. That's why I'm late sometimes. I get too into it. Yo! Crit! Oh, that's the wrong attack. It's Poochie in it. That won't work. Oh! It kind of worked. Lole! <laughs> I'm not gonna read your chat message. That's just not a nice thing to say, Keelan. You know what? I want everybody who's watching right now to click go live right now. Also, make sure you buy a physical GBA just like me. And play this game yourself. And have a handful of people roast you all the time. Feel my pain. I have two? <laughs> Wait, just like me? I only have one. You're so cool. It's refreshing seeing someone go at their own pace. Are you joking or not? I can't tell if you're joking. <laughs> I just realized how big end that was. Dude, if that would have been your first time chat, I would have banned you. Not even kidding. <laughs> Wait, I did astonish again. Wait, I'm so pink. It's not very effective. It did half his health. Chad is roading you? It's roasting. Learn how to spell. Go back to school, Meg. See, you roast, I roast. We all roast. Might as well invite you all to Thanksgiving at this rate. You're salty? Yeah. So is your mother. <laughs> Tell it. Fuck. Tell her to have some pineapple next time.
You know what? I think Pokemon brings out, like, a bad side in me. I think I should stop playing. I haven't, like, gotten super mean, but my, my comebacks are, like, not chill. <laughs> it's okay, it's how Peace and I speak, yeah. Billy's still new, they don't know the vibe yet. They've only dipped their little toes. Oh my god, level 11, let's go! Wait, look at the timer. Gasp. Don't tell us, John. Um, somebody type exclamation point discord in chat, please. I'm too focused on my game right now. I'm gaming. Thank you, Mac. <laughs> there really is a command for everything? Yeah, try, um, exclamation point. Your mom, see what happens. Or wait, do exclamation point secret. Secret. No, I, I don't have a your mom command. <laughs> Wait, I do have a your mom command. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that was my secret. <laughs> Man, that was a, that was a good setup. That was actually a pretty good setup. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I don't have a Discord because um you know, we're not friends. I'm sorry. You, you guys can treat my chat room like a Discord server that you guys basically do already. You have an unofficial one? Okay, Mac, who is in the unofficial server? I need to know. All I know is that it was you, Kim, and Koboba. You're telling me we're not besties? No, I'm sorry. Billy, you've only been following for like a day. It's- wait, what did you follow? Yeah, you've been following for barely two days. You think we can, like, skip five steps and become besties? That's not how it works, honey. Dude, I love how Matt calls it an unofficial server and it's literally just a group chat where they giggle and get in VCs and giggle. Welcome back. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Yeah, the reason why I don't have a Discord, it's in the command. I, I, we're not friends. And also, like, if you guys have direct access to me all the time, then I know you won't watch stream because you're gonna have my attention all the time. Like, you're not gonna click the stream. Maybe we can have a Discord, but not associated with this particular Twitch channel. Actually. Eh. Just behave. Just behave, please. Don't groom each other, please. That's for Minecraft YouTubers. Yeah, no- no- No minors. Like, I, I said before, like, I jokingly- what is my sub goal? It's- it's in my about section, I think. But I, I jokingly say a million subs and I'll make a Discord. There probably will come a time where I do make a server for subscribers, but it probably won't be a long for a long time. Um, because like I want to be able to like pay anybody who is involved with me like officially. Like if I have a Discord, I would pay the mods. If I have Twitch mods, I would pay them a little bit, but less. <laughs> Um, and then also, like, 
I okay. Do not cancel me. But I think small streamer Discord servers are cringe. Because all you have are people saying, good morning, good night, have a good day. And like, they're not actually like chatting as much because there's not enough people in the server. Like, okay, if I have, how many followers on Twitch? Like, 832. How many followers do I have? Somebody tell me. I, I don't check it often. Like, if I have 800 Twitch followers, I have an average of five viewers on a good day. If I have, like, a Discord server, it'll be, like, one person saying hi and good morning every day. And that's cringe. And then I would have to say hi and good morning back. And then that's also cringe. I don't like any good morning text if it's not from your mother, okay? So, I think Discord servers are only fun if it's, like, a larger community. Like, I'm personally... I... I'm in the Connor Eats Pants server, but, like... I only joined for the emotes. <laughs> and then I'm in Squeaks' Discord server, but that's because Squeaks' Discord just posts bald memes and they're really funny. Because you know what? I'll never go bald. Yeah, I know we got a good handful of younger people, and that's fine. Obviously, chatters don't leak your age if, you, if you're not an adult, or just don't leak your age at all. I think most of my viewers are like college, so like my age. I did graduate last year. I'm still working on paying off my tuition so I can get my diploma. And also like, I I was also, I'm also in Emmy Beef's Discord server and I usually just like react to like little funny jokes she says. Or like I'll reply to whatever she says because like, I don't know. I'm 20,000 year years old. You sound like the people. Like, you sound like Loli! <laughs> I don't know where that bit was going. I, I know the direction. I just didn't take the right path. Anyway, what was I saying? Uh, also, like... I've... I've been in other smaller streamers discords and like there's some like creeps like there's some like really weird people Like there was one person who posted like sh trigger warning self-harm trigger warning over and like I didn't see the pictures thank fucking god but like the, the issue is when you don't have a lot of moderators like it's very easy for things to slip through the cracks like it was in the server for like an hour it's like, holy shit. And it's like... Also... Like, if if I'm the creator, obviously I have like a level of power. No matter how big or small I am, like, there will always be people who want my direct attention. So you, you don't know, like, how people will act when you give them that attention. Or if you don't give them attention. Like, you know, stalkers, all that cool stuff. You know, like, the people who stalk the grocery store, of course. Um, and it's like, I just don't want that shit. I don't- I don't need that in my life. I already got enough, uh, shit up here. Fun memories. It makes the streamer feel responsible if that stuff ha happens. Exactly, like, I would feel horrible if, like, somebody was harmed in my server. Like, cause that's my community, that's my space. And I want to make sure any space that I have is as safe as it can be within my control. I'm seeing Chip's chat messages. <laughs> oh my god, Lolly grew to level 12. One more level, and then we can switch out Lolly. For a better anime genre. Yeah, so it's like, that's why I don't have a Discord. I feel like we have this, like, full explanation, like, every three months. Like, all, all the old viewers are like, eh, skip, skip, I know the drill.
Glad I was the quarterly reminder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we need a skip button for real? If you're watching the VOD, just skip like five minutes whenever somebody types Discord in the chat. I also think, staying on Discord, I think it's a red flag whenever like a smaller creator pushes their Discord a lot. Now, I know some of my friends do this, and I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about other people. Like, why are you telling me first time chat to join my Discord? I, I literally have only known you for two minutes. Why are you trying to get me in a secret group chat? Because, like, we know. We know what happens in, like, private conversations. It's like, I don't want to be groomed. Because I'll be honest. <laughs> The, the reason why I've been single for so long is because, like, I know, like, I would be so easily, like, manipulated. Like, I know, I'm so, like, gullible. But don't worry, if somebody treats me bad, I will leave. I hardly use Discord anymore, only to chat with close people. Yeah, I only use Discord to talk with Emmy. That's it, really. If someone says gullible is on the ceiling, I go, huh? And I look up. Are you one of those people where it's like, hey, you got something on your shirt and then you, your nose gets flicked? Do you fall for that one too? I don't fall for that trick anymore. 100%? Okay. <laughs> Guys, we can troll Billy a little bit. They're sharing so much already and it's only their second day. We got so much ammunition. Okay, seriously, I've, I've had to have, like, run into a hundred Pokemon. C-Dot. Imagine. Lole! <laughs> you know, I regret and then also love that I called him Lole. Your authentic GBA said, see, don't. That's actually pretty good. Write that down. I'll steal that for later. You know, like, 90% of streamers' jokes are just stolen from chat. We know that, right? That's why I try my best to improv a little bit. I say what you say, and then I say, haha, blank, blank. I miss playing games as a kid on the school bus on my GBA. You know what? I can do that too. I sit like this when I'm at my computer. <laughs> Sheesh, I'm funny. Controversial? <laughs> Never mind. I think Mac is like a 7 out of 10 funny. It's because Mac doesn't try to be funny. Mac usually just chimes Lo Mao whenever I roast them, and it's pretty good. Same with Gobobo. They're they're just here to vibe. And but then since they react usually with their chats, whenever they do have a funny one, it hits. When we have like a new chatter like Billy who does try hard, and usually it pulls off. It pays off, not pulls off. I accept if I don't have a comeback. <laughs> I try to be funny, I can't lie. No, we, we love the funny chatters. Because you guys are adding. You guys are adding to the stream. The 
The main reason why I quit watching TikTok is because everyone has the same jokes and everything gets repetitive. No, literally, I said this like two years ago. The whole issue with trend content popping off and doing well is that it kind of discourages creativity. I think that's why like TikTok openly said last year in one of their like conferences that they're pushing more original creative content, like artistic stuff, because then you're actually rewarding people who have semi-original ideas. And the issue with, um, like, trend content is that you already know the punchline, so it's very hard to transform it. But then also, when you know the punchline, it kind of feels like an inside joke. That's why it does so well. It's very normy. It's for small brain people. Which, I am not small brain, I have a very big brain, you guys know that. I haven't been on TikTok in so long, I don't know what's going on. Me too. I don't look at my For You page that much, I usually just upload and close the app. It's because whenever I open TikTok, I get an ad straight away and it pisses me off. Then just give me a little funny video. Yeah, I think the best description of TikTok is that everybody is trying to yuck each other's yums. There's like so many debate antis. There's so many antagonists. Like people who just like want to say that you're wrong. Even if, it was, if it's for something little, like having a tea sandwich. And filming it and saying it was delicious. They're like, you fat ass bitch. That's why like, I'm glad that my account is still kind of small. I don't get a lot of shitters. Oh no, Instagram reels, their comment section is so toxic. I literally, my Instagram comments are the only social media platform that I restrict comments on. Because whenever I have a real pop off, Pop off meaning get more than 500 views because IG Reels is dead. I get a fat comment, guaranteed. I get a sexist comment, guaranteed. And it's like, what the hell? So, <laughs> it's kind of cool. Because Instagram, you can restrict your comments with so many different settings. I personally use only followers can comment. And that has helped so much. Because now, if somebody wants to leave a shitty comment, they have to follow first. And then, if they leave a shitty comment, follow, unfollow, I can see their profile. I don't say anything back, but like, I'm like, oh yeah, he looked like a bald ass bitch. Oh yeah, they look like they're forever alone. But ever since I started restricting my Instagram comments, I get like, no hate. It's, it's like, really nice. Also, on YouTube, my New Year's resolution was to not look at my flagged comments, which I haven't done since New Year's. I'm really- I'm getting really good about it. Because I would go to my YouTube flag comments to, like, whenever I felt sad, I would just wallow in the sadness and, like, look at all the fat comments I would get. And it's like, I just don't want to entertain that negative side of myself anymore. So, like, I don't even look to my flagged comments anymore. Sometimes, like, comments will, like, slip through. Because the- <laughs> Literally, I had to block the word salad from my YouTube comments because people were like, oh, you should go eat a salad. And it's like, what the fuck? Like, I don't like vegetables. Like, don't tell me what to eat. Toss- No, like, because I'm fat, Mac. Like- <laughs> Um. <laughs> no, Mac, you're trying to be funny. You're trying to be funny. But, like, my YouTube comments have gotten a lot nicer. Who knew that, like, making rules and restrictions would, like, lead to less negativity? Hmm. That's, like, that's the big reason why I use 10-minute chat on Twitch, too. Like, especially for live content, you don't want to have, like, bad words on the screen. And if some bozo follows and, like, wants to say dumb shit, they're not gonna wait 10 minutes. They'll just go to another sucker who doesn't have any chat rules. Or restrictions because I use 10 minute chat I use um, verified chatter so you have to have a verified account and a phone number linked to your account unless it's been X amount of days I don't know the amount of days and like ever since I've been using those settings um, I basically have had no shitters come in 
It's pretty nice. That 10 minutes will boost your analytics too? Yeah, have them watch an ad and watch 10 minutes of the stream first. Yes, sir. And even then, like, I'll have people follow during the stream and then unfollow. <laughs> and I'm always tempted to, like, ban them, because, like, if somebody unfollows immediately, I'm like, oh, that's probably, like, somebody's alt account. Like, should I, should I just give them the smack? But then I don't, because I'm like, eh, it should be nice. What if, like, I become famous one day, you know? I don't want to be, like, mean. Um... Ooh, Lolly is so close to leveling up! Oh yeah, and like, also, if somebody is willing to wait 10 minutes to chat, then they're probably gonna be like a regular viewer. Because then if they if they sit for 10 minutes and enjoy the 10 minutes, then they'll probably like the rest of the stream too, let's be honest. And like, I know a lot of people say, don't do 10 minute chat, it kills your growth. It kills your growth, you'll never be big. But it's like, I don't care. Like, if I'm small forever, oh well. It's not meant to be. I, I do this to have fun, not to make money. And ultimately, I care about the safety of my viewership, my community. Ew, I hate that word. Cause like, imagine... There's one channel that I watch, I'm not gonna say, but you can maybe, um, connect the dots. They love beef. Anyway. Like, they don't use 10 minute chat, and any- any time they're in just chatting, they always have, like, some creep come in. And it's really awkward because whenever you have a new chatter, you want to give them attention. But, like, if it's somebody saying, like, weird shit, you should not allow that in your chat. Usually this person deletes it, but sometimes they miss it. And it, it's like, for me personally, I don't want any of my viewers to feel unsafe because, like, one rando. Because, like, if somebody makes me uncomfortable, it's probably going to make you guys uncomfortable. So it's like, I just, if, if I do 10 minute chat, it basically avoids that entirely. Wait, watch this. Watch this. Lolly grew to level 13. Let's go. Hell yeah. Lolly learned nature power. Ooh. You know what? I'm surprised none of my Pokemon are evolving yet. Is that bad? That's where you get community, and that's why I love this. Thank you. See, I gotta stick to my rules when I'm small. That way, when I get bigger, hopefully, things will stay good. Okay, so right now, Lolly's at level 13. So my next one I have to level up is Gus Wingle. Dude, my nose is so itchy. Itchy ni sanshi goroku. Okay. Also, guys... We are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes, and you get a diamond chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Turn the heart button purple. I don't know why I say the heart purple thing. I just saw somebody else say it, and I was like, that's kind of cute. So I, I stole it. Give me a C dot. Imagine. Yeah, if somebody watches your stream for 10 minutes, then they don't got the TikTok attention span either. Exactly. Like, I don't want people to follow just to follow. I want you to follow and, like, genuinely watch and enjoy what I do. Like, follow count is cool and bigger number, better person most of the time, but... I want people to, like, actually enjoy what I do. Also, it looks really cringe if you have a super large follower count and, like, low viewer count like me and, like... If you have 800 followers, you'd probably be averaging 10 viewers, but, like, I get a lot of crossover from TikTok. And because of that, not a lot of people watch the stream. Because, like, transitioning from, like, one-minute content to five-hour content is totally different. So I appreciate anybody who does follow, but... I'm just watch the stream, easy. Poor Brendan at the top. He must be exhausted. He's been biking for hours. Um, Billy, I'm sorry to break the news, but that's not real. It's a video. <laughs> but how? <laughs> Dude, Billy's such a good chatter. He's not real like your GBA. No, this is completely real. See?
Billy is gonna turn evil like all of us? Yeah, I was just gonna say, I need to stop praising Billy. He might like it too much. He did ask if we had a Discord. Red flag. Gus grew to level 7. Gus learned Super Sonic. Yo. Let's check out this Super Sonic. Supersonic emits bizarre sound waves that may confuse the foe. Give me an offensive! Sorry, I'm like chuckling. Thinking about how long this is gonna take. <laughs> when should I start like gaming? Yo. <laughs> Soon I hope. <laughs> I don't think the C dot likes you. I was thinking about that. I was like, are any of my Pokemon holding like anti C dot spray? Oh, I'm using water gun. I'm I'm like zoned out. Oopsie. Wait, Gus only has water gun! Okay, let's do supersonic confuse him. Maybe he'll attack himself. Even the rings look like Sonic. Well, Botad is confused. It hurt itself in confusion. <laughs> I'm back again. I don't know what chat was lagging. Yeah, if, if there's any issues with Twitch, always refresh your tab or close and reopen the stream on your phone. I've been having issues, too. But welcome back, Andrew. You know what's funny? Watching Twitch on the TV has, like, less delay than watching on the phone. It's kind of crazy. Like, the chat is super quick, but the actual stream video is delayed. It's weird. Hi, Ethan. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. You know what, Ethan? I played this Pokemon game just for you, and I'm not even kidding. Clarify, I I crossed my fingers, and I, that means I'm joking. If you're an audio listener. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you liking it? Yes, sir. No, because like I forget that like a good handful of people in general will put streams on the background, which is what I do. I just put it on the TV, and I do other shit. Like, I'll boot up Supermarket Simulator, and that's my day. Okay. Gus, you fucking suck. I'm switching. If I see a low dad, I'm switching. You know, I have yet to beat my first boss. I mean, my first gym, but you know, we'll get there. Easy. Oh wait, Mudkip is gonna level up. Mudkip grew to level 13. Let's freaking go. Okay, so anytime I see a low Ted, I just have to immediately switch to Mudkip. Since my Wingle only knows Water Gun. Evolve it? I can't yet, right? Wait, no backseat gaming! Mods, get him! Oh 
Oh my god, Gus is going to die. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> when am I gonna be modded? Wait, what do you mean, Mac? You said you did not want to be mod. I can literally leak our DMs. You can't untake your no. You can't do take backsies. Um, for context, I offered Mac to be my mod, like... Wait, almost two years ago? No. Was it a year ago? It had to be almost, like, a year and a half ago, I think. And it was so cute, Mac was like, you know, I have I have a lot of other obligations, and I want to be like, I want to be good and make sure I can be a good mod, I don't think I have the time right now. <laughs> it was really sweet. What are the rules? Ethan, read my title! Literally, my title says, parentheses, rules in pin chat. I'm sorry, but I think you need to go back to school. I'm being serious. It's pretty self-explanatory. Yeah. Ethan likes not using his eyes. Yeah, I think we came up with that earlier. I'm on mobile, I can't see the whole title. Oh. But you can still see the pin chat! Do you- Okay, do you guys not look at pin chats when you open a stream? It's the first thing I look at. That's why I made it the pin chat and not a command. No? Yeah, Mac, you disabled the pin chats, which I think is so stupid. <laughs> the people I've dated would prove that, right? <laughs> Got him. I love when you guys roast yourselves. No, I do not look at the pinned. Yeah, then that's a skill issue. Literally, I was so happy when they added pin chats. I was suggesting pin chats in the Twitch surveys for months, and then they finally added it, and it's so nice. Because now, instead of saying, oh, hi, so-and-so, this is what we're doing today, la la la, I can be like, pin chat, pin chat. That way I don't have to do the whole, like, one-minute spiel every time I get a first-time chat. It's pretty nice. Also, I can, like, link my YouTube videos and then you guys will see it whenever you click on the stream. And then some of you guys will click on the YouTube link and then watch the YouTube video. The pin chat takes up too much of the chat box. True, this is a long pin chat. But it has all the rules in it. Like, if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. Okay, let's find that fucking- freaking sea dog. That was a very useful pin chat. If only there was a way to know it was there. Skill issue. See, Ethan used to be like a troll, and then he became wholesome, and now he's just like DUM. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You're so smart. <laughs> Don't cancel me. <laughs> A roller coaster? That's the people he's dated? Got him. What happens if I don't find a seed on? It's like sinking in. What if I like- what am I gonna do? I said I was gonna like find one and then move on, but like if I don't find one... Why can't you just move on past this point? Cuz I'm stubborn! Also, there's a prediction on the line. I said if my party gets to level 13 for every member... Or C dot. So I guess once they get le everybody leveled up. I don't know. I'm like, 
I'm having regrets, and I usually don't regret things. And I keep getting haunted by zigzagoons. Where are your shinies? It's only one in every 4,000. Okay, where's my C-Dot then? Allegedly, C-Dot is one in every 100. I have for sure fought 100 Pokemon today. Um, actually, one out of 8,192. Get him, Billy. Who's the bigger Pokemon nerd? Maybe wrong area? No, this is the right area! It's Route 102! I knew it would be an erm actually bitch. Shut up. Shut up. Oh my god, I'm Gus to level 8. Holy moly. <laughs> you know, I got the erm bit from a chatter. That was one of Hacker's bits. Because he would always do erm in the chat. And then I just copied it. Man, where is Hacker? They probably got skew. They're getting smart. There should be- Oh, I was gonna say there should be a way for me to like, revive the Pokemon that I release. But there's no way to bring them back. What if there Okay, what would it take for- What should I do that you guys agreed to to like, have me bring back a Pokemon? You should play more Game Boy games in your Game Boy? Yeah, of course. I'll just gotta find more cartridges, of course. They got a few of my local shops. Oh yeah, put it in the box. Oh. But releasing it is like so much more fun. Cause like then it could come back. Like, for example, if since we had to get rid of Wurmple, what would what would I have to do to be able to catch another Wurmple? Yeah, sad did come back. That was crazy. What if, like, if it's a Pokemon that you guys kill, like, let's say the Pokemon was worth two subs, in order for me to get it back, I have to give two subs. This is all, like, hypothetical, because I only have $45 in my bank account. I think that would make sense. Like, if we do this next year, and by next year, of course, I'll be, like, a huge streamer. Like, I think that'd be a good deal. Yeah, I will do a Pokemon Nuzlocke every year, I'll commit to that. But, like, and then the other rule can be, like, if the Pokemon faints, then it's dead forever. I think that's totally fair, because, like, having it faint is, like, my fault. If he even finished this one this year... I bet you had that one typed on your laptop for, like, ten minutes. You're waiting to launch that joke. And you know what? It's pretty good. We're almost at ten hours. Do you have any queso discourse for us? I don't... I don't know much about queso. All I see is clips. And also, um, Ethan, you should know this already. Um, no drama farming? I'll ban you, I'm not even kidding. Ethan always comes in, he's like, Have you heard about this? Or this? What's your opinion on this, microphone emoji? Who? You don't know who queso is? Man, you guys need to watch other streamers, but, like, still keep my tab open. Holy shit. How do you not know who Queso is? I'm aware of- I haven't, like- I've watched- I think the most of a Queso stream I watched was, like, 30 minutes, and he was playing a horror game. <laughs> I like the news, but sorry. <laughs> Dude, I swear- I'm sorry, Ethan. I goof with you a lot, and I, I jokingly will say I, I will ban you every single time you come in chat, but I won't. Unless you say, like, something really heinous. <laughs> I'll be honest, I was playing a game and I heard queso, and I thought you meant your opinion on cheese. You know what, I'll give my true opinions on queso. 
I don't like queso. The cheese, of course. The streamer is Ite. Yeah, he gets a lot of shit for being overweight, and that's not chill. But it's like, it's unavoidable to get that type of... To get that type of, like, criticism or hate. Because fat phobia is so prevalent in modern culture. It's kind of like being any other marginalized group. It's just part of your daily life. Like, you can't, like, stop it. It sucks, but it's you just gotta learn to be tough. That's the unfortunate reality. Like, you can have safeguards in, in chat or your social media, but pe some people will slip through. Clipped in, edited. No! Don't edit my clips. I did say that I'm gonna, like, open and, um, remove the copyright on my YouTube VODs. That way you guys can make little fan edits and compilations. And I'm, like, I'm kind of scared. Because what if somebody makes, like, bad compilations? They're like, every time peace is racist, and it's, like, poorly clipped and shipped, like, me saying, like, out-of-context things. I'm scared. You guys have to promise to not do that. Is Wingle your favorite so far? No. <laughs> I I'm trying to get my whole party up to level 13 before I do the first gym. It's because, like, if the Pokemon dies in game, it dies in real life, so, like, I have to let it go. So, I'm trying to... Because I only have... I only have seven Pokemon. No, I... No, I have eight Pokemon. I, I, I have- I have- a, I had a total of ten, I released two. So I only have eight Pokemon, so like, I can't afford to have another one die. Sad is my favorite? Yeah. I like Mary too, but it's also because we've seen them the most. Okay. Um, I forgot I need to not fight the low tens. I, I literally zoned out. I'm not even looking at my screen. I'm looking at chat the whole time. Mudkip. Mudkip. I'm still thinking about, like, what stream I want to do for April Fool's this year. And of course, it's gonna be a serious stream. I would never make a joke on April Fool's. <laughs> an, an idea I did have written down is... Making Pokemon sounds? But, like, taking it really seriously. <laughs> like, doing impressions of every single Pokemon. <laughs> and, like, not giggling. Like, being 100% serious. That would be funny. Prank your sister by replacing all the milk in your house with mayo? Plot twist, she hates milk and mayo, so she would actually not care. Gus grew to level 9. Let's freaking go. You should do that, but just look at the picture of them. Just look at the picture of them. Or, <laughs> or like, I do a cover of the poker rap, and instead of, like, using the actual images of Pokemon, it's just me shittily drawing the Pokemon. Does this Pokemon have date lock Poke- Wait. What's a date log Pokemon? What what is that? Somebody tell me. I don't know what that is. I don't play this game. I don't know the the gamer terminology. It's like in Sword and Shield, some Pokemon will only appear on certain real-life dates. What? I didn't know that! That's crazy!
Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think this game is, like, that smart. But, like, imagine the reality it does, and CDOT just doesn't spawn on Wednesdays. And they only spawn on Tuesdays. Wait, today is Tuesday! Shit, today is Tuesday. Erase that. Am I gonna do a poll for which game I'm gonna Nuzlocke next year? Um... Maybe? I don't know. I kinda liked how I just dropped the stream on you guys. Because I usually leak what I'm going to do on stream, but... I mean, I kind of did leak I was going to do Pokemon, but... I kind of liked how I didn't tell you what game until, like, the very end. You know, I, I like the idea of you guys following my channel. And then it's just a random grab bag of what I'm going to do. Yeah, Mac knew already. They hacked my Discord. I actually hate Mac now. That's not a lie. My fingers aren't crossed. I'm an unpaid intern. No, you're not. Okay, can I link? I'm gonna link. I asked Mac. I was like, hey, Mac, how do I get a GBA for myself? You know, how do I do that? And they were like, okay, I can do it. And then they worked on it. They sent me like this really nice and organized like Google Doc with links on how to do everything, how to download it, all this jazz. And I was like, Mac, please let me give you like a gift card or something. Please let me do something. And they were like, no. I wanted to do this. I am a Giga Chad. Do not pay me. Wait, Mac, I said I would give you VIP. I told you I would give a VIP to I wait shit. I forgot. So and then I said, Mac, I will give you VIP during these streams. And you know what? I'm gonna follow through on that now. VIP Mac. There you go. I don't remember that. I told you that, like, in chat one day. It was fun doing the research. See, you are such a sim. You are such a sim. Stay here forever. Mac, welcome everybody to new VIP in chat. Your badge disappears when I beat this game, which... Could be forever. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I forgot to give you the badge. <laughs> I literally said... Where's the Google Doc? Um, I don't want to share it because it has accounts linked to it. Which, obviously, your mother's Google account, too. I would like to thank the Academy! <laughs> but thank you, Mac! Yeah, it's like, seriously? It was your throwaway email? Okay, cool. But anyway, it, it's our little secret. You know what else is a secret? But actually, not really a secret. How to avoid ads. Because, guys, we are four hours into stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing. For $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a subscription available. Also, if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. I think. Okay, my theory, my game. Th you guys are waiting. Oilers, you're holding. You're, you're gonna wait until I get to the fucking gym. Please don't. Please don't. Anyway, get boomed. Why is Mac VIP? Um, because Mac is secretly my favorite chatter. I'm sorry to break the news. You ran here. Mac, did you tell your little group chat? <laughs> 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 yeah, Mac made me like a Google Doc that had hyperlinks and like where to download the games, which consoles to get. And like it saved me probably like three hours of time. So genuinely thank you, Mac. I already told Mac I was gonna give them VIP. I told- I told chat this. 
Is Mac permanently VIP? No, only until I beat the game, which could be permanent, let's be honest. Guys, oh my god, we're at 10 hours? Double digits, everybody, you were here. You know how earlier I was talking about how even if you're a small critter, you still have power and influence over your audience? Like, Mag was, like, happy with getting VIP and not getting a $25 gift card. Like, they'd rather have the clout. Which, honestly, having a VIP badge in the Peace and Chat Room is very rare. I only have... I only have three actual people who have the VIP badge regularly. And then one person gets it every month for being the best flipper. You know what's really funny? <laughs> anyway. Yeah. So, having the VIP badge is very rare. In my channel. I know we just hit 10 hours, but at least my splits are still green, right? Dude, Mag is trying to get the VIP badge again. They're begging for side quests. <laughs> okay, can I, can I leak this joke? When, when Mag said that, like, they were like, Oh, you don't gotta do anything. I do this for fun. <laughs> I messaged them. I was like, side quest, Andy. <laughs> I thought it was so funny. But Mac didn't reply and I felt sad. I was like, dang, the joke didn't hit. You're not wrong. Yeah. You didn't you didn't even give me like a little laugh. I was sad. Left on scene, yeah, and it was on Discord too, so like you don't know if somebody saw your message. Yeah, Mac <laughs> it's really Mac treats me like I'm their actual boss. They're like really eloquent. Oh, I need my kit. But you know that's good. I don't I don't want no Sims. Plus Mac has a GF now. You know, we can't have her thinking that Mac is DMing other girls. Yeah. Either way, thank you, Mac. For the most part, viewers respect my boundaries and I really do genuinely appreciate that. Like, I don't get DMs. Nobody has, like, tried anything. <laughs> but that's also because, like, I don't allow it to happen either. Like, I don't- uh, and most of my DMs are closed. They're only open on Twitter, but that's, like, in case, like, I get a sponsor. Like, maybe, you know, one day. But nobody has crossed any lines. And, like, I would feel really bad because, like... Imagine, like, how do I say this? If you don't see a chatter anymore, then, you know, they got in trouble. Or they just don't like the stream anymore, and that's also bad. But no, I would like to clarify, nobody in my chat room has gotten in trouble yet. I haven't had to ban any viewer. Which is actually really surprising after streaming for almost three years. Like, genuinely, that's very rare in a small chat room. Usually, like, somebody is a freak secretly and they expose themselves in multiple ways after, like, a year or two. So, like, no bans is wild? Yeah. I've only banned, like, um, people from other chats. Like, if somebody gets banned in a, a streamer friends chat, then they get banned here, basically. Yeah, we- I- oh yeah, there was one chatter who was, um, too young. <laughs> but, you know, that- that's just, like, TOS. Like, obviously, like, no miners in chat. You, you have to be 13 to have an account, so... But that's standard. Like, nobody has, like, acted out. Unless... Who wants to be the first person to get banned of the peace in chat? 
Type 1. One point five. <gasps> Another route? No way. No way. Okay, I've already caught a route, so I can't catch it. Okay. This is the first rare Pokemon we've seen today. Um, I was gonna say maybe we can still catch him that way I can evolve it, but I can just evolve my normal routes anyway. So we're gonna kill this guy in cold blood with Gus because he's my strongest guy. Peace, I do seven routes. I had to kill you. I'm sorry. No matter how rare you are. And Gus grew to level 10. Nice. Yeah, guys, put your little emotes in chat. Get your urges out. Okay, out of the new sub emotes I enabled, put your favorite one in the chat room. What's your favorite? I added five new ones last week. Oh, I forgot to switch. <laughs> Ethan, you had those Pokemon emotes ready. <laughs> Ay, Dio mio. Yeah, I think my favorite is Peace I Too No Way. It's so good. No way! <laughs> Okay, you guys are free. No more pictures. Also, earlier when I said who wants to be the first person banned on the channel, I legit, if somebody would have typed one, I would have timed you out for 10 minutes. Not even joking. I would have done it. You gotta put your money where your mouth is. Thankfully, nobody did, because I would have felt really bad. No, you can't do the bit now. I already told you the joke. Mac not even five minutes with the VIP badge and already abusing it. Just classic Mac behavior. What do we expect, honestly? BRB? I literally just posted a TikTok clip being like, the moment people get a VIP badge they never watch. And you know what? It's happening in real time. I'm so disappointed. I hope Mac heard that. No, but for real, like, that's why I don't mod or VIP people easily in my chat room. Because people just want the clout. They want the badge. They want to feel special. And when you give them that little bit of attention, they'll never watch you again. I'm a prime example of that. I have mod in, like, three channels, and I don't watch them anymore. That's because they don't stream anymore, because they're small and they quit. But don't worry, Rainy is going to start streaming again next month, so...
You know what would have been a good comeback? You guys could have been like, well, Mac has more badges than you because you have no badges in Pokemon. That would have been a really good joke, and nobody made it. I think you guys should all go to improv class, not me. You aren't checking all of the grass. The C dot could be in the top left one. I don't. I don't think that's how it works. We had our routes in this patch when we've already been grinding this one patch for like an hour. I don't think it's it's the amount of steps. I don't think it's the location like within the actual grass patch. Cause some grass patches will give me more low tents, but I don't think it really matters. Also, um, no backseating. That's your second warning today, Ethan. Your game is broken? Should I return this? I'm gonna put my hair up. It's been four hours. I have this scrunchie today. It has a little ribbon on it. Oh wait, that's so cute! Wait, I wanna see. I haven't worn this one yet. It looks like... I'm from the Roaring 50s, and I'm in one of those ads. Oh, that's too long. I don't want ears. <laughs> no ears. I'm looking at my OBS. Yeah, maybe. Guys, I'm a girly. I don't know. I, I, I ruined it. I ruined it. The ribbons are too long. I don't know. Wait, actually, I hate the scrunchie. Dude, I did it perfectly earlier and I messed it up. Because the, the actual ribbon gets caught in the scrunchie, too. Wait, I'm ruining my speedrun! Should I stop my timer? Oh no. See, look, it's getting caught in the scrunchie. Can we try one more time? This is scrunchy percent? It's okay? Okay. See, th this is too long. That looks stupid. Yeah, okay, maybe I'll go like this. I hate it. Okay, well... It looks so stupid. Eh, whatever. It's in the back. You can't see it. I'll see it! <laughs> I'm tucking it back in! I'm not a furry! Dang, I thought this scrunchie was gonna look so cute. I'm hiding it. Just like my feelings. I think it looks cool with it long. No, it looks like ears. I- I ain't- I'm not a furry. Okay, I'm back in.
I think you ruined your speedrun 200 grass patches ago. I ruined my speedrun seven hours ago. You guys said the world record is like three hours or some shit. It's fine. Um, who's here for the long haul? Type 1. You know what? You guys think I'm the sucker for possibly spending like 100 hours on this game? But I think you're the bigger suckers for watching me play it for the full playthrough. Not, not saying that you should leave, but like... You're a sucker. I'm playing my own Pokemon. That's what you sound like, I bet. I jokingly will do like different chatter voices, and I just like to picture this what you guys actually sound like. Like I have the oh actually I, I don't really know. Or I have the oh hello. How are you today? Those are like the main voices I use to like mimic chat. And if anybody does sound like that. I'm sorry. Oh, what do I sound like, huh? And that's what you sound like. That's like your real voice. <laughs> I was gonna say, what do you guys think I sound like, but... I think most of you guys know. <laughs> I sound gay? <laughs> Wait, do I sound gay? Be honest. Type 1, if you think I sound gay. I don't think I sound gay. I don't think I look gay either. And I wonder why I don't have a GF. Okay. On um, Twitch dub, I do have a rainbow emoji in my title. Yeah, you did tell me Kobobo sounds like James Charles. getting there. How many more Pokemon do I have to I should save. Man, 10 hours. <laughs> yeah, I really got Gus and Ron to level up. We're getting- we're getting there. Jim- Okay, I, I surely will beat the gym today. Ten hours and zero gyms? Shut up! And I said this before, if I was playing this by myself, I would be grinding this much too. I'm not doing this just to stall and run more ads. No, no. I would actually play like this by myself. I, w I would be with my GBA like this. Yes, I need to get to level 15 or 13. Oh, no she dot I'll keep looking. I would never, like, fake it for stream. Unless it's my laugh. is so strong. Gus grew to level 11. 
Okay, surely I have to find a C-Dot. If I've gone two rounds, I have to get a C-Dot soon. Gifting is going to do nothing if if you have six high level Pokemon. You think level thirteen is high? But don't no no Oilers. Wait, wait. You guys would just have to gift a lot. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yeah, wait, yeah, wait for late game. You guys gotta play smart. Where do you get your chair? I'm in search of a chair that wouldn't give me back or neck pain. Well, <laughs> bad for you. This one, <laughs> this is not an ergonomic chair. <laughs> Sorry, I love how you assume that this is a good chair. <laughs> I know you're being genuine, but... <laughs> um, it's from Ikea. It's like one of their default, like, office chairs. I got it, like, three years ago. Um, the seat cover? I would recommend getting a seat cover if you get a chair like this, especially if you sit, like, crisscross. Because you can get, like, a cushiony seat cover, too. In different patterns. But this is not- this is not a good chair. <laughs> I would not recommend it. Hashtag not sponsored. Uh, no, don't get this chair. <laughs> Guys, click the link on my TikTok shop and get 25% off. No way. It's actually 45% right now. Buy it now. And yes, I get a, a royalty income. I get paid on the 20th, so by gym 3, I'll be primed to wipe out your team. Okay, it's not going to take me two weeks to get to gym 3. Uh, guys, I'm going to be streaming this every day until I beat it. Um, besides Friday because sub only, and then besides Sunday because St. Patrick's Day stream. <laughs> Another reason why I love TikTok. Yeah, like, the TikTok shop is so annoying. I was at first excited for TikTok shop because, you know, I was like, man, if I make a TikTok about my art, I can, like, easily pin the actual art or whatever, the painting. But then I was like, after a year of seeing the UI be available, people are like, they hate it. They hate it. So if I feel, I feel like also putting a TikTok like shop product on your video makes it so much more disingenuous. And we all know that most products on TikTok shop that aren't from, like, creatives are just drop-shipped dog shit items. They gotta be. Well, one hit KO, easy! Okay, genuinely, if you guys kill any of my Pokemon today, I'm gonna cry. I'm not even kidding. We've come so far. Also, I'm getting hungry. I'm probably gonna eat at the next ad break, so in 30 minutes. You know what else it's time for? Um... Telling you to follow. If you're new here, click the follow button. Turn that heart purple. Because if you're watching and you aren't following, you get a much better experience when you get to type in chat. You know what? I will say hi to you if you type in chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Um, someone type in chat and I'll tell you hi. Um, somebody type in chat. Oh my god, hi, Mac! <laughs> oh my fucking god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, what, what do I do? What? Okay. 
So I scream so loud. Everybody in the house probably heard that. Okay. Um. Uh, my lowest level is Ron. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do Ron. Because I think Ron has um, health drain. And I don't think that'll kill. Tackle, absorb, stun spore. I'm gonna do absorb because this will not kill C dot. I've never seen it absorb like one hit KO. Okay, okay, okay. So we're just gonna spam absorbs. See you don't unleash energy. Don't kill me, please. That did a good chunk of damage. I'm not gonna risk losing my shroomish. I don't have my berry. I planted it. Because if that attack does that much damage for like a normal and not a crit, if he crits me, I. It's Jover. Just throw a ball? Should I? No, it, okay, if 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 Cedar only does the explode move, that means I have like two more turns. No, I have three more turns because Ron is faster. I'm I'm just gonna absorb. Yeah, like two more absorbs max. Also, hi Kim, can we get some Yo's? Why do you want C dot so bad? It's not that I specifically want C dot. It's just I want one of every Pokemon. And how long did we spend searching for C dot today? What, three hours? So shut up. Sorry, that was mean. I'm I'm angry. I'm stressed. Okay. One more observe, and then we'll throw a Pokeball. Only 15 XP. The emulator has a rewind? No, I'm playing for my GBA. It did a crit. I did not think I would crit. Okay. Since I killed CDOT... If I find it again, I can catch it. you this would happen? Did you? I'm looking at your logs. I'm looking at your logs. All you said was OMG. This hurt more than me being laid off. That was pretty good. That's a pretty good one-liner, Kim. You should not go to comedy class. You're pretty good. Okay, did the gamble say catch or find? I didn't clarify. Okay, it just says see dot first. I think saying finds implies it. So you know what? I found a C dot first before leveling up my whole team, so you know what doubters? C dot, you guys win. 
I cannot believe I killed C Dot. I didn't mean to. I'm like. Let's get everybody to level 13, go to the gym, and maybe I'll come back. I'm out of PP. What did Ciro ever do to you? He, he hid forever, and I didn't like that, so I got angry. I, like, lashed out. I had to kill him. That's what I do with, like, everybody who leaves me. I'm like not even giggling because like I know that's like such a good moment like genuinely that's a great moment I love fails but three hours it's okay so now you found one you'll find another one easy thank you I think that way too guys I don't I'm fine. I, I'm just like disappointed. You were here. <laughs> At least I made a clip. <laughs> I'm writing down the timestamp. I want to. I want to watch this back and like see the light leave my fucking eyes. This is worse than getting last in Mario Kart. I used- I need to switch because it's low tad. If it would not have been a crit, it would have been fine. It's not often the absorb even does a crit anyway. Maybe you'll be playing all year now? Haha, <laughs> funny joke. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm faking being sad, I'll be honest. <laughs> I was acting, was that good? Holy shit. Yeah, another three hours. Oh my god. I- it- I genuinely did not think it would have ended that way. Cause, like, I'm surprised that Absorb didn't do more damage, like, anyway. Cause it only did, like, a quarter, so, like... Yeah, I got really unlucky that I got a crit for once. Okay, well... Let's do another prediction, guys. Let's do the same prediction. Do you think I will level all my Pokemon up to level 13 or interact with another C dot? Go Gamba. I only have two more Pokemon to level up, so. Maybe we'll find another C dot. But it is kind of hard. It is kind of good that I. That I, um, I saw a Routes and a C dot. That means with time, I'll find any Pokemon. Cedon has a 33% catch rate at 100 HP. I, I don't ever catch Pokemon when they're at 100 HP. That's not how I play. The odds of me finding another Cedon? The Cedon stocks tanking right now. <laughs> Wait, I just remembered. There was the one guy who said he'd trade me a Routes for a C-Dot. Uh, but that would be breaking the rules because I can only catch one Routes. How many are left? Two Pokemon. And then my whole team will be leveled up and ready for a gym. I was talking about Routes and then I get a Routes? Okay. 
chat. Can we make a deal? Can we make a deal? I killed my C dot that I could have caught because of an unfortunate crit. There is a person who said if I give them a route, they will give me a C dot. And we do know the Trini Pokemon is like really cool. So, will we allow this? Um, let's. I'm gonna end the prediction now. Let's do a poll. Routes. Catch, but must trade. No. We'll catch. No. Okay, so to re reiterate, the rules of this run are I can only catch a Pokemon of every single type once. So if I catch a Pikachu, I cannot catch another Pikachu. But there was one character in Rustboro City who said he will give me a C dot if I trade him a Routes. So this is a poll for now only. And anytime this scenario comes up, of any exception to the rule, we'll do a poll. Because I'd rather you guys decide than, you know, I scan. So, the poll is, routes. Am I allowed to catch it, but I must trade this specific routes? It doesn't matter what moves it already has, I have to trade this one. Or, no, I cannot catch it at all. We're only doing this because routes is kind of rare. So, go vote in the poll. What do you guys want to do? Personally... I'm torn. I think staying to the rules of not catching is like true to the run, but after seeing me lose the C dot brutally, I would love another chance to get a C dot without grinding for hours. Go vote now. Go vote now. I'm genuinely contemplating. Yeah, that's why I gave you guys two minutes. Whew. I'm torn. I don't I don't know what I'd vote for. Guys, go vote in the poll, please. If we have no voters, then I win. I get to pick. And either way, if I catch those routes, I'm still gonna grind till I get to level 13. So there might be a chance of me naturally getting another C dot. Okay, we already have one vote for no catch at all. That's not chill. That's not cool. I hate that. Oh, come on! I'm voting. I casted my vote. Uh-oh. Guys, you have 30 seconds. Go vote. What do you think I should do? I'm waiting. Vote! 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 Stop the steal. Guys. Guys. I'm screenshotting it. That way VOD watchers can see it. Guys. This is what you guys voted. Routes. Catch but must trade or no no catch no tie. One of the votes was me, but I'm not going to say which was me. Come on, really? Okay, well... We could do a coin flip. Hmm. You know what I'll do? I will let the top gifter decide. Kobobo, I know you're in chat. What do you want to do? Pay to win. I'll let you decide. Kobobo, if you're in chat, I know you're here. Should I catch routes? Or kill routes? You get to pick. Don't catch- FUCK YOU!
See guys, if you donate so much, you get to choose what happens in the stream. This is so mean. Oh, seven routes. <laughs> it's my own choose my own adventure. <laughs> I'm never gonna get another seat on again. I'm gonna quit streaming one day, and this is gonna be the this is the stream. When you guys ask why'd you quit, I'm gonna link this freaking stream. I'm fine, I'm not angry. <laughs> if I would've chosen, I would've been like, no, you stay to the rules, peace in. No catching. That's what you said. Okay. <laughs> Make I quit command and link the clip. <laughs> That'd be a good bit. Oh my goodness. Back here. But like, genuinely imagine I get another C dot. That would go crazy. That would be like, the plot of a movie. Rising action? Climax? Falling action. Conclusion. <gasps> well... Some of you guys were chirping about maybe it's the wrong grass patch. What? Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is the third route we've seen today. I've merged two of them. It's almost like a sign. It's a sign! How are you finding routes so much? My uncle works at Nintendo. Okay. This is a sign! You know what? We're gonna do another poll. We're doing the same poll again. This- this is weird! Especially, like, right after. And you know what? You get only a minute this time. Four routes equals one C dot. So your odds are in right now. Okay, go vote. What do you guys want? This is... This is a song? From who? I don't know. What do you guys want to do? Can I catch it, but I have to trade it? Or no, no, catch it all. And the reason why I'm doing pulls is because I'm broke. I'm not going to do a sub... Incentive. I ain't doing that. I'm broke. I don't get paid till tomorrow. Go vote right now. Do you think I should keep or kill routes again? Ah! Sorry, it changed right at the end. <laughs> You guys are so mean! You guys wait till the last literal two seconds. Okay, I'm putting the results on screen. Results are now in. You guys voted. Majority, no. Somebody put a vote in last second, and it genuinely scared me. <laughs> so, we're killing this route too, apparently. <laughs> Voted to catch- I didn't vote in this one. I, did, I voted in the last one, but I didn't vote this one, because I thought that'd be fair. Okay, well. There goes another chance at a C-dot, because of chat. You know, you guys are my 13th reason. I'm sorry, that's not funny. Okay, it would've killed him anyway.
Imagine this in other routes. <laughs> you know, Nintendo's just really taunting me at this point. Okay, whoever voted to, like, let me catch the routes, can you please tell me who you are so I know who, like, is a real fan? I want to know who, like, is a real one and not a fake fraud. What is going on? What is this? Okay, we're not doing another poll. Obviously, you guys don't want me to keep them, so we're gonna kill them. What is this? Why are there so many routes? Can you see who votes what? No. I can only see the amount for polls. It's kind of like the election. I'm not allowed to see who voted what. Ooh! Gus grew to level 12! We speed running. Sorry, my sister texted me. I'm gonna have to mute in a little bit. Not now, though. So many zigzagoons too. The game is taunting me. It literally is. Or maybe it's confused that I'm just killing every single rare Pokemon. <laughs> it's like, why is he killing rounds? Let's give him another one. Okay, I got a mute.
Okay, sorry, she had to grab something real quick. She's adding time to the timer, yeah. I think she's on your side. Also, something flew in my eye. Man, Gus is so strong! Okay, I am gonna run into the problem of if I run into a new Pokemon, I probably will want to hit KO it soon. So you know what? I'm gonna change the strat. I'm not gonna level up my Shroomus to level 13. Because now that I know that the gym is rock-themed, I'll probably just kill them all with my water Pokemon. So once we get Wingle to level 13, we'll just go to the gym. That way, if I run into Seedot again, I can just do Absorb and not one hit KO. Which... I'm going to run into a Seedot right now! Uh, imagine. <laughs> that would have been crazy. Low dad. Oh, I forgot. Wrong move. My XP bar isn't even going up. Mm. Grinding here is probably not the best spot. But I want another Sea Dot so bad! Give me another chance. Ooh, that went up by a little bit more. Come on, give me a C dot. It has to happen statistically. Yeah, it's honestly... You know what? I don't believe in statistics anymore because we got four routes. Which should not have happened.
misclick. Make mud keep it so strong. You know what else is pretty strong? Resisting the urge to run an ad. But you know what? Sometimes I gotta do it. Because we are five hours in a stream. So it's time for me to run an ad. Um, I'm not too happy. I killed CDOT. So, guys, if you want to avoid that ad, subscribe. You get cool emotes and ad previewing. I don't even know my spiel. It's time for me to run. You can avoid the ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad previewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for fewer Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a subscription available. Also, if you subscribe today, you can kill my Pokemon. But, you know, you can't kill CDOT because I didn't catch CDOT. So, subscribe now. Also, when I'm running the ad, I'm going to go grab my food. So, I will be right back. Okay, let's stop my timer. Okay, I will be right back. BRB. While I'm gone, put your favorite emote in the chat. Put your favorite emote. Okay, hello. I'm back. So, I will eat my lunch whenever we level up Seagull. Or Wingle, not Seagull. <laughs> okay. Let's restart my timer. There we go. We're back in. Lotan. Yeah, it should take like two Pokemon more, I think. And then Gus will level up. Yeah, the problem is I keep running into Lotans. Let's do Ron, actually. Get him in there. Even though I said I'm not gonna level up Ron, why not give him one kill? Give him some action. Wait, he did get one kill. He got C-Dot. 
<laughs> okay. Gotta get up early for college. Gonna head off. Thanks for watching, Billy. I hope you have a good rest of your day. And thanks for watching. Thanks for goofing and gaffing as always. We'll see you next time. I'll probably stream this tomorrow too. Because tomorrow I'm either gonna do Pokemon or edit. And honestly, I wanna do Pokemon. I'll probably edit on Thursday. Uh, it's gonna be like two or three more Pokemon. Dang. Okay, back to the ground. Come on, another little dad? Just give me another seat off. Get him, Gus. And Serio? I'm getting out of here. I just don't want another low tad. I want another C dot. <laughs> Stop.
I'm gonna need to go heal Ron after this fight. Okay, we're out. Seedot is such a hater, I know, right? We're at 11 hours. <laughs> and still no gym? <laughs> Misclick. If I'll actually get another C dot. Like, what if, what if I did grind for another three hours? You know what? My Pokemon are so strong, I'm probably scaring all of them away. I think that's why C dot took forever. Probably my final fight and then Gus will level up. Yes! Gus grew to level 13. Let's go. Gus learned wing attack. <gasps> Finally, another offensive move. Okay, let's check that out. Wing attack. Strikes the foe with wings spread wide. Accuracy 100. Yo, that's pretty good. Okay, so now... Let's go through all my Pokemon. Wingle now has two offensive. Supersonic and Growl. Meryl has two offensive. Shroomish has one offensive absorb, which I think is OP. Low Tad has one offensive, which is a ghost move, absorb, and two status moves. Puchiana has two offensive moves. Mudkip has two offensive moves. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Most of my Pokemon that I leveled up, or all my Pokemon that I leveled up, have four moves now. Okay, I'm going to save here. Okay, save the game. Okay, I'm going to pause my timer. Okay, timer's paused. I'm going to eat a little bit. So, you know the drill. Let's put on a little YouTube video. Okay, I have to close this. That way it doesn't capture the sound. And I'll put on a little video as I eat my food. And you know what? No other than... For the Peace and YouTube channel, click subscribe weekly stream highlights. Let's watch the most recent video. 63 views, holy moly. Okay. And let's do YouTube full screen. I also have to use the restroom too. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I'm here. Hello. YouTube time. Okay, so I should change my category. Yeah? Okay, I'm gonna like eat my food. It'll be like 15 minutes and then we'll get back to gaming because yesterday I ate way too late in the day. So let's watch a little video. Let's unmute the video. There we go. I'm going to be opening the Pokemon Trick or Treat. The Pokemon Trick or Treat Booster Bundle Pack. This has 
It might be a little 50 soft. 50 little booster packs in it. No, I this will not one. be giving these to the kids. I'm just going to put all the cards in a bowl outside. Okay, I'm going to use the rest of them real quick. For right this year. They don't get the glory and joy of opening the packs themselves. Uh, make sure you guys eat. Make sure you guys get your snacks I'm too, okay? I'm for 25, so I, I just scanned myself. Why do they look like a pack of Oreos? Because they're delicious. Don't... Potato was, like, famous for eating cards. Potato, be honest, how tasty does this, does this look? <laughs> a solid 8 out of 10 for deliciousness? Nice. Very nice. I did print off a list of all the actual card values. These are courtesy of tcgplayer.com. These are the listed, not the medium prices per card. I will reveal this at the end. Also, it's flip for you guys, so rotate your cameras. Do not spoil the prices. I still want a pog and feel like I make a profit. There's six different holo rares that I can pull, which will be Chandelure, Dusk Noir, Gengar, Spectier, Trevenant, and Marshadow. Those are the ones we want and need today. I've never opened Pokemon cards before, so hopefully I don't tear them. Guys, do you think I'm gonna make a profit? Type one. So my goal today is... <laughs> To make more than $25, surely. We have the overhead camera today, guys. I doubt you will tear them. I have scissors. I can cut them open. You're gonna sell them? Surely. Yes, I'm gonna make so much money. <laughs> Let's break this bad boy open. Cut her up. Then no, I will not be resealing these and selling them as a scalper. That is unethical and... They should be jailed. Slash J slash SRS. Okay, let's do a little of this. Oh my god. Look at that. I've never opened Pokemon cards new. I would like beg my parents to get them. Even if I didn't play the game, I just like the pictures on the cards. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Parents, what's I'm happening? Never Pokemon cards. <laughs> okay, not gonna lie. <laughs> Sorry. I have big kitchen. I'm eating my lunch. And I have a uh, grocery store sushi. Because yesterday, I didn't eat till late in the day and I stayed up all late so like I have to eat now so we're watching my most recent YouTube video while I eat you know been like 10 15 minutes taking my union break you know <laughs> it smells kind of good like you know that new plastic smell Christmas morning that's what it smells like oh my goodness oh I, I thought they had different text in the back I'm gonna go ahead and read the back text what Pokemon surprises hide inside Halloween night is filled with frightful delight as ghostly Pokemon and their friends join the fun. Gengar, Mimikyu, Poltergeist, Grevard, and a horde of other shadowy Pokemon bring tricks and treats for the spookiest celebration of the year. And Pikachu's tagging along too. Wait, I missed one. One, I almost got scammed. Okay, nothing else is in here. So if there's 50 packs, do the math, guys. That means there was 150 cards to open today. There's 30 different individual cards you can pull. Wait, it's not... It's not opening. <laughs> um, guys... Can I not? Am I... Am I... Oh, wait, wait, I got it. I'm not weak. Use scissors to get through the middle of it. Every gifted sub, I will cut a card. I'm not even kidding. Okay, we, we kind of split ourselves. Let's see. The Litwick? Ooh, how? Wait. Already? Hollow Marshadow? Hollow is just in the background, not on the actual Pokemon. Ooh, wait. Gage? That's kind of cool. And then a Miss Magius. Okay, not bad. I left spaces. Oh, here, so you can actually see. Oh, no spoilers. But I'm gonna tally and mark how many of each card I get. That way I can like figure out the total profit or net loss I make at the end. <laughs> can you make a profit? That'd go crazy. Yeah, just looking at the prices, um, <laughs> it would be insane. So wait, the hollow was the second one, right? Okay. Th this is how the pros do it, right? Wait. Okay, I did the rotation wrong. <laughs> okay, I got uh, Mimic You. Oh, this one has a hollow border, too. Gage? Okay, these actually are kind of cool. Oh, no. Have I become addicted already? Murkrow. And finally, Lampert. Okay, six original cards. No doubles yet. I love this hollow border a lot. 
I like the hollow when it has like the pattern foil. Like that's my personal favorite. Okay, genuinely, I think the Pokemon X evolutions are D-U-M. Why is this genuinely so hard to open? How do they expect like little four-year-olds to do this? Okay, I'm doing the rotation wrong. <laughs> Wait, is there gonna be a hollow in every pack? A Spectrier hollow. A Lampert again. Another Murkrow. Okay, if there's gonna be a hollow in every pack, then that's kind of DOM. It's just like inflation. You're just pumping in specials when they're not truly special anymore. This one is pretty though. The horse? I've never seen this Pokemon before. Is this why they're putting out a whole bunch of like unicorn flavors? Oh wait, even the Pikachu is hollow too. It's very subtle. This pack seems like such a scam. I mean, I feel like it's marketed for people to give away for trick-or-treating, so I don't think it's for like actual collectors. Another hollow Mimikyu. A phantom. It looks like a worm. And then a shuffet. I like this art a lot. It looks like it's from the anime. Just fully 2D colored flat. Okay, I think it was center card is hollow. Oh wait, I just showed you guys. <laughs> guys, I'm a pro. I don't know how to do this. Zubat, another flat color. How does he only have one move? Zubat sucks. Wait, do all the- wait. No, some of the cards have two moves. Okay, it's not just me. Ooh, another hollow. A trevenant. A tree. We should chop him down. And then a Grevard. This was like the most annoying Pokemon to catch in Pokemon Violet. He, he genuinely made me mad. Oh wait, this one's a hollow rare, guys. Bog. Give me a Charizard. It's not opening. Guys. Ooh, this guy looks sick. I thought it was Greninja, but it's not. <laughs> Delmise. Wait, it's literally just a steering wheel. I hate the new Pokemon so much. Ooh, a hollow houndstone with a holographic border. Am I thinking of like a full hollow card? Miniature plume. Cute. Okay, I'm just gonna pull from the top. I don't care. What is this one? Driftlin. This is from the Pokemon Pikachu Adventure game. <gasps> oh my god, Gengar! This this is supposedly the most like desired card in the whole pack. He doesn't even look that cool. He doesn't even look scary. I wish they made these Pokemon cards look like genuinely frightening. And then, Bennett. Okay, this one would look very pretty as a hollow. You know, the classic Tumblr galaxy background. How much is it worth? I'm not leaking the prices till the end. Guys, watch till the end to see if I made or lost money. Oh wait, Bennett is a rare. What? Wow, piece of making a profit? Yes, sir! To the moon! A Galarian... What? What is this? Galarian Runerigus. It looks like trash. It looks like literal trash. <laughs> oh, Miss Magius. Ooh, Hollow Dusk of Noir, holy moly. I remember seeing the one Pokemon movie that has May in it and I was really scared of this Pokemon. Okay, not gonna lie, the Hollows are kind of lame. I like the ones without the pattern foil. Dusk Noir is one of the Hollow rares available. A Lincoln Rock. This was another one that was really difficult to catch in Pokemon Violet. <gasps> oh my God. Hollow Pikachu? I didn't realize Pikachu was gonna be a hollow. Wait. This is my favorite. Finally a yellow card. This one is actually a really cute illustration too. It looks like the world of Detective Pikachu. I like this one. Holy moly, look at that. Cute. And then Murkrow. L. It's a common. This doesn't feel right. Are there hollow versions of common cards? Is that like common knowledge? I'm gonna put Pikachu on the side. 
because he was not listed as a hollow card. Maybe, maybe, maybe this is the million dollar card. Officially, I have 10 packs open. We are one fifth of the way through. A haunter? Holy. Look at that tongue. <laughs> Ooh, a hollow chandelier. It'd be cool if the different holographics had different colors. Because it seems like all of them have that rainbow chrome effect. And then a shop it! Oh, this one's cute! Ghastly, I like the swirl illustration. See, I don't care about the actual Pokemon. I just like how they render and draw the Pokemon. Ghastly. Grevard. And then a hollow. A hollow houndoom. Okay, this one's actually sick. See, how cool would this one be if it had like a red hollow effect instead of rainbow? The foreshortening on this one. This is a really nice illustration. Wait, houndoom is a common? Wait. Setting that one aside with Pikachu. Sinistay. Straight out of Beauty and the Beast Castle. Drift Bloon. And hollow. Another Marshado. There are only three cards that we haven't seen yet. A Poltergeist. This, what? I don't get the name. It's just a pot. Driflim. And then a Hollow. Another Secretary. People get addicted to opening Pokemon packs. I don't think I've had the, a good hit yet. And also, like, there's only three in every pack, so, like, the anticipation isn't, like, I'm not on the edge of my seat every time. Not saying this is bad, like, it's still fun, but it's not hitting. I feel like since it's meant to give out to little kids on Halloween, it's probably why they put a hollow in every pack so the kids don't cry. Valid, but, you know, yeah, I guess I'm not the target demographic. Oopsie. The skull. Miss Magius. And finally, another Mimikyu, Hollow. The only card that I didn't tally off was a Dusclops, but I think I got a Dusclops already. Oh, I got a Dusk Noir, not a Dusclops. Okay. <laughs> you should open them all at the same time like it's one big pack. You guys want to do that? I can do that. I just won't look. I'll open one more and then we'll open like five at once in one big stack. Okay, I just realized whenever I take the cards of the pack, I'll probably like bust up the edges a little bit because i'm kind of rough ladies okay <laughs> phantom driftlin and another dusk nor hollow okay so now i'm going to open five packs at once okay so i'm just gonna open five at once and put these into one big stack so this is 15 cards in one stack five packs Hit them all at once. I'm gonna pull from the top because it'll be easier for my hands. Who thinks I'm gonna get a Charizard? Miss Magius. Ooh, a hollow chandelier. A Delmise. Drift Blim. Another hollow Pikachu! My second favorite. Zubat. Grivard. Another hollow Gengar. And Lampert. Puppet. A hollow houndstone. Okay, my left arm is hurting <laughs> from like holding up the cards. My left arm is bad. It's been sore for like two months now. Guys, streaming is hard. A Litwick. Murkrow. I forgot to unmute, guys. I 
think I'm ready for some gaming now. I ate my lunch. I had sushi. It was just grocery store sushi. But you know what? It still hit. So, took my little Union 15. Back to freaking gaming. That was good. Thank you guys for letting me eat. Normalize eating on stream. I'll be the one to do it. I'll take the hit. Okay. We are back in it, everybody. Oh, I have to reopen the game. Shit. Sorry. I. Is, <laughs> the reason why I mute when I eat is because I... I click my tongue a lot. <laughs> it's embarrassing. We're back in. Dun! There it is. <laughs> Imagine I didn't save. <laughs> we're back here. Okay, we're in. Um, I gotta make sure everything is correct. Restart my timer. 11 hours. <laughs> Holy moly, 11 hours. Holy shit. Okay, let me start the timer. <laughs> this is wild, shut up. Wait, start the timer! I pressed the wrong button. There we go, I'm back in. Guys, where we left off, I ate lunch. And now, we level up all 13 of my Pokemon, so it is finally time. After this fight, it is time to face the actual bosses. The gym, the, the, the first gym leader. Oh, wait, I have to get through the forest. Shit. <laughs> okay. Go, Gus! Actually, no you're not. We're gonna swap in Ron. I'm gonna make Ron my party leader. That way, he can tank when we go through the forest. Ain't no way, guys. Yes, it's finally time for the battle. Also, to end the prediction from earlier, will I level 13 to my whole party or see C-Dot first? Um, I did not see another C-Dot. Sag. Ron, kill him. <clears throat> Man, I feel so much better after eating. Oh my god, I think I think I was just hungry. Who knew? You're not you when you're hungry. Hashtag not an ad. Okay, be honest. Whenever I eat, do you guys mind if I put on a YouTube video? I think that's totally fine. Cause like. The reason I put my videos on is because like I don't want any, I don't want no drama, and I think getting people's permission to react is the way to go. Unless it's like a big company. What? What? Huh? What do you mean what? Yo, mama. <laughs> My mom just came home, yeah, from my place. She flew over. On my private jet that I totally have. This click. To Rustboro City we go! Oh wait, I gotta make... Shroomish my leader. Okay, I'm gonna rearrange some of these guys. I 
I like that order for now. I'll probably rearrange before I get to the gym. We continue on. <laughs> to Rustboro! Wait, are there any Pokemon I missed in 104? Wait, let me look. When am I gonna get to the gym after the forest? Oh wait, this is Route 104 too, it's not just behind the building. So I- the only Pokemon I haven't gotten in Route 104 is Taylo. So if we find a Taylo, cool, if not, we'll come back. <laughs> we'll come back! Okay, Ron is my lowest level party member, but I'm only keeping him in the front because he's good against the grass Pokemon and he has absorbed. And I want to level him up subtly. <clears throat> Ron grew to level 10. Ron learned Leech Seed. Ooh, let's check that out. Leech seed. Plants a seed on the foe to steal HP on every turn. Ooh. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Let's continue on. Oh, they're growing! They're dancing! That's so cute! Of course they're delighted I'm watering them! We continue forward to the woods. Surely nothing bad will happen. Let's test out this leech seed. Wild Rumble was seated. Ooh, that's crazy good. I love that. His seed fell. Oh wait, does that mean it works? I don't know. No say. Good job, Ron. We continue on. Maybe we'll get a tail, maybe not. Oh, it's a Silcoon. We have one already. Could it be me? Wow. Oh, that was a crit. I thought that was normal damage. Let's try Leech Seed. Mm -hmm. 
So the leech seed only takes away a little bit of health, but that's still good. Because that can maybe possibly avoid like a final turn where they have like very little HP. I missed! Easy. We continue on. Wait, a cascoon! New Pokemon! A wild cascoon appeared. Okay, I don't want to kill it. I'm gonna do absorb at the start and then tackles because Casco is just gonna harden. For some reason, it just didn't occur to me that there would be cascoons. I don't know. Wait, this would be our first Pokemon of the day! <laughs> if we catch it. You know, Seedaw could have been my first Pokemon of the day. Maybe I'll catch another one. I'm gonna do one more hit. It should not kill. Okay, we're good. Now, moment of truth. Pokeball. Please, give me a Pokemon! Yes! Plus one! We got a Cascoon! Let's name her Cassie. If you can't tell, I have an affinity for old lady names. <laughs> Finally, new Pokemon. Okay, I wanted to get an encounter in every bush. That was my goal. I want to get a Taylor too, if I can. But if not, it's fine. I got a Cascoon! XP I should have been grinding here. But no, I wanted that sweet C dot that I didn't get. Okay, I want to see if I can get anything here. Give me a Tilo. Nope. And it's fine, I'm not upset.
<laughs> we continue on to the gym. We're gonna do a quick heal, and then it's fighting time. I'm also going to rearrange my party order. I want to put Mary in the front, because why not? Now, since it's a rock gym... Yeah, Lolly doesn't have any water-type moves. I don't want to start off with Mudkip. I kind of want to challenge myself a little bit, even though there are kind of higher level. Oh, wait, did Lolly learn a new move? Yeah, they have Astonish. Yeah, they don't have any water moves. So party order is Mary in the front. Gus, Mudkip, Lolly, Ron, and then Sad. I think I'm ready. And we're in. Uh oh. Do I have to fight them? Oh wait, I can just avoid them all. No, for good faith, I'll fight them. I'll fight them all like you're supposed to. We might be in the middle of town, but so what? My rock Pokemon need room to rampage. I'll fight all the encounters. Hiker Mark would like to battle. Wait, he's level 8. Water gun. I also, I don't have any money, so I can't buy heals either. So I just have to... Oh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> 147 XP! I would always avoid every single trainer. No, I like to fight them all. I like grinding. I'm not swapping. Okay, you guys want to do a prediction? Let's do a prediction. Do you guys think I will beat the gym, including the encounters and the leader? Beating means I don't completely die. Completely dying would mean I reset. <laughs> Which, surely, surely, I'm leveled up and up and I have water type, so surely, I will not die. 
The odds of me completely wiping my whole team is minuscule. I, I do anticipate that the encounters are going to be lower level than the actual boss. Oh man, oh man. Our challenger is one feisty customer. He's got $320 for winning. Wait, can I... Can I go back and buy more heals? If you can't beat me, you won't stand a chance against Roxanne. Youngster Tommy would like to battle. Okay, maybe I actually hate not, like, actually fighting and just 1A KOing. Maybe I hate this. Mary Goodall level 14, holy! Youngster Tommy is about to use Geodude. I'm gonna change, yes sir. I'm gonna level up Gus. Water gun. Okay, I'm looking at the prediction with 100% believe. Nobody thinks I'm gonna fail. Nobody thinks I'm gonna have to reset. And you know what? Thank you. Wow, you've got some potential. Peace and got 128 Poké Dollars for winning. Thank you. I have faith in you. Thank you. This is why I spent... Five hours grinding. <laughs> I cannot afford to lose. Don't take us gym trainers lightly. I'll show you why we're better. Youngster Josh would like to battle. Okay, does everybody just have a Geo dude? He has a level 10. Uh oh. Take this. Easy. You are too good for me. You got 160 Poké Dollars for winning. Geodude scare me in battle? Like, he looks scary? I'm gonna rearrange my party. I wanna switch Mary for Gus. There we go. Hi, Kim. Oh, hello, sir. Yo, how's it going? Listen, my friend, would you like to become the champion? I'm no trainer, not me, but I can sure give you winning advice. That's settled then. We'll aim for the Pokemon Championship together. It's your job as a trainer to collect gym badges, am I right? But gym leaders aren't pushovers, and that's where I come in. I'm here to provide expert advice. Roxanne, the gym leader, is a user of rock-type Pokemon. The rock-type is very durable, but it can't stand water-type and grass-type moves. Come see me afterwards if you beat the gym leader. Well, go for it. 11 hours is crazy? You've never played this game, so you don't know what, like, is quick or slow. What if I'm, like, speedrunning? And this is a playthrough, not a speedrun. Just to clarify. <laughs> for anybody who's confused. And Roxanne, here I come. Hello, I am Roxanne, the Rustboro Pokemon Gym Leader. I became a gym leader so that I might apply what I learned at the Pokemon Academy, or at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle, and with which Pokemon? <laughs> this is a slow speed run? Yeah, it's more like a speed walk, not a speed run. Does this even classify as a speed run? Um, I don't think so because I did it in two settings. I don't think you can like pause your timer for an actual speedrun. You have to do it in one sitting. Because that way they don't know you're cheating. Okay, I'm in. Let's see if I lose. I want to get a sprite on the screen today. Leader Roxanne would like to battle. 
Leader Roxanne sent out Geodude. Level 12. If you can't tell, the first thing I look at is level, because, you know, bigger number, better person. Water gun. Um. <laughs> Gus, J Gus gained 220 XP points. Leader Roxanne is about to use Geoda. Why do you have two? Silly? I'm not changing. <laughs> okay, maybe maybe I over leveled a little bit. But I'm only one level above. Gus gained 220 XP. Gus Griddle, level 14. Leader Roxanne is about to use no nose pass. I don't know what type nose pass is. All I know is that he's a nose. That acts like a compass. <laughs> Why is he dancing? <laughs> um, water gun. It's super effective. That's it, a third. Oh, Harden? Yo. Bow nose pass fainted. Gus gained 346 XP. Player defeated leader Roxanne. So, I lost. It seems that I still have much more to learn. I understand. The Pokemon League's rules state that trainers are to be given this. If they defeat a gym leader, please accept the official Pokemon League stone badge. Peace and got 1500 Poké Dollars for winning. Peason received the stone badge from Roxanne. The stone badge heightens the attack power of your Pokemon. It also enables them to use the HM move cut outside of battle. Please take this with you too. You obtained the TM39. That technical machine, TM39, contains Rock Tube. It not only inflicts damage by dropping rocks, it also lowers speed. If you use a TM, it instantly teaches the move to a Pokemon. Remember, a TM can be used only once, so think before you use it. Easy! Let's freaking go! Did I win the gym? All encounters? Yes, sir. I might have overleveled, but you know what? That five hours of grounding was worth it. I love one hit KOing. I'm so good at this game. I love Pokemon. Also, thank you for the follow. Plus one. Can we get some yos? Hello. Sorry, I was in the middle of the fight. I didn't want to, like, interrupt my fight. I was focusing. I was gaming. Okay. Now, I know cut. It took 11 hours? Shut up! I know- I can- I can see the timer, too, you know? I just spat on my monitor. <laughs> I got so mad. <laughs> okay, let's talk to this bozo. Whoa, what a breathtaking victory! My cheering must have worked. Great. Check your trainer card. The stone badge you got should be properly recorded on it. In other words... You've climbed the first step on the stairs to the championship. That's gotta feel awesome. Thank you, sir. Now, can any of my Pokemon use cut? Use. Boot it up in HM. It contained cut. Teach cut to a Pokemon? Yes. No! <laughs> None are able to cut. Um, I have Silcoon, Cascoon, and Routes. Can I only teach to my party Pokemon? Okay, don't tell me if any of my Pokemon know. I I will I will I want to see for myself. Let's freaking go, guys! What the hell? Okay, first, you know what? It's finally time for... 
I beat a gym leader, it's on screen. The first gym leader, Roxanne, defeated. <laughs> I finally get to use my overlay. <laughs> okay. I watched the whole movie and you just beat her. Um, one movie is six hours long. What the hell? Okay, you know what is kind of long? An ad break. But you know what? Sometimes I have to do it. Because you know what? I hate you guys. I'm kidding. <laughs> Guys, we're six hours in the stream. It's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad for viewing on the phone. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for food Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a sub available. Also, if you subscribe, you can kill a Pokemon. Three subs and I release Cascoon. Yeah, Cascoon. I gotta update my list. <laughs> my phone just turned off. <laughs> I forgot to charge it. Classic. Dude, I don't understand how people let their phones get, like, below 25%. If you do that regularly, I think you're, like, kind of silly. It's crazy you're not a bigger streamer. Your streams are great. You know, I saw the first half of your message, and I got kind of sad. I was like, is this a... Is this what you call a gaslight? <laughs> okay. 3-12. Cascoon. <laughs> what? No! <laughs> now, nah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. One day, it'll happen. Just, like, um, click the share button and send it to 20 of your friends. Then we'll get popular. Okay, so on my list of Pokemon, I have them in order. I should write down their actual names. So, um, I'll do that at the end of stream. Just remind me, okay? Remind me to write the names. That's hilarious. You think I know 20 people? Um, let's see. I know 20 people. Um, let's see. Max mom. Vacant's mom. Computer's mom. Who else is in chat? Drew's mom. Who else is here? <laughs> um, I gotta scroll up. Keelan's mom? It was just Mother's Day in the UK? Okay, let's continue on. Um... Well, oh, I gotta- I gotta put it on a screen, huh? Dude, 11 hours! <laughs> I cannot! <laughs> okay. Can, editor, just take the timer off screen. Just take it off screen. Put something else. Not my mom! <laughs> okay. Are you even close to finishing? You know what's funny, Vigadin? Genuine question. You wanna see something funny? So I made this overlay. I'm I'm unhiding everything now. So in this game, there are 12 main fights you have to do. So on my overlay, if throughout the days, this indicates how many of the bosses I've beaten. So I know you don't play Pokemon, which I don't either. Which is maybe why it took me 11 hours to beat the first boss. But I have beaten only one gym leader. Yeah, I just got the first badge. <laughs> Wait, only one? I can't save him in a cutscene! But thank you, Drew, for reminding me. Okay. Wait, okay, let- Wait, my timer's still going, my speedrun is ruined! Stop yapping, let me- let me game. Okay. Get out! Get out of the way! Wait, please! Don't take my goods! Oh, wait, the guy in the gym was the guy in the woods. Wait, let me save. Would you like to save? Yes, sir. Guys, you were here. I beat the first gym. Okay, um, what should I do? Before I go follow, I'm gonna go heal, just to be safe. Wait, I think all my Pokemon are at full health. <laughs> I don't think I took a single hit. Yeah, I'm at full health, okay. Um, I'll, I'll figure out the cut stuff later, I just wanna see the cutscene. We need lore. Route 115. 
What's the average playtime? I looked it up, it said 40 hours. Oh, wait, where'd they go? I wanna go save that man. He gave me... a badge icon. Oh, hello. I went the wrong way. <laughs> oh, it's you! You're that fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalburg Woods! Help me! I was robbed by Team Aqua. I have to get the Devon goods back. If I don't, I'm gonna be in serious trouble. Wait, it's 40 hours for 100% completion? Stop. Wait, where do I have to go, sir? That shady character, I think he took off towards the tunnel over there. Oh, okay, so I was- it's to the right. He's and found one repel. Oop. Pucciano. It's like 15 hours for the main game, and that's if you're taking your time. Wait, I'm taking my time, though! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, okay. Pokemon games are supposed to be grinding. Am I not supposed to grind? She's got four hours left. Good. Okay, am I genuinely stupid? <laughs> Guys, I can't. <laughs> oh no. You are <laughs> aware. <laughs> but you were grinding low levels for your high Pokemon. I was trying to get a C dot. I I I wanted a C dot and I got a C dot and then I killed it. <gasps> oh, See, now my problem is, I have no Pokemon that are low level. Okay, why, was, why is the tail- uh, Fuck, I messed up the joke. I'm scared. <laughs> why is Taylor growling? He should be chirping. Like Twitter. Okay. Um, absorb. Please don't kill, please don't kill, please don't kill. Oh. Oh my god! Stop! I wish I could see, like, the number of HP the opposing Pokémon has. That would be very helpful. Is he gonna explode? He's getting pumped. Okay, don't kill, don't kill. Okay, we're good. Um, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared! Okay, he's growling. One more tackle, and then I'll use a Pokeball. Pokeball time. Let's go! We got a Taylor, everybody! I've decided I'm gonna try and name every single one of my Pokemon. I'm gonna name it Taylor. And if your name is Taylor and you're watching, um, this Pokemon is for you. Mm-hmm. Just for you. Wait, how do you spell Taylor? Uh, okay, I'm thinking Taylor like a coat Taylor. It's T-A-I. And then Taylor- oh yeah, Taylor Swift, okay. No, it's not- this is not for the Swifties. This is for people who are named Taylor, not- not the Swifties. Don't come for me. Wait, 
I think I, I... No, you know what? Screw the Swifties. Let's do Taylor, like a coat Taylor. I think that's funnier. I actually love that. Taylor! <laughs> okay, adding Taylor to the list. We've caught two Pokemon today now. Oh my god, only two? Ideal meal. Let's continue on. Hmm. I want to go swap out my Taylo. Taylo? I wonder if Taylo can learn cut. Cascoon looks evil. Hmm. I already have so many water Pokemon. Let's swap them for Meryl. Taylor's got full HP. Okay. Let's make Taylor our party leader. Now we are gaming. Oh, you know what I should do? Mm, I was gonna say, maybe I should not have a full party. That way when I catch Pokemon, I'll keep them in my inventory. I think I'll try that. I'll put some of them away. Cause then for the next game, I need Pokemon that are level 15 to 18. Any Pokemon that are higher level, we'll put on the bottom. And I'll move into different boxes eventually. I'm just messing around for now. Yeah, because since I don't have XP share right now, I don't need a full party. Okay, I got two empty slots, so if I catch two more Pokemon, I can level them up quickly and not have to go to a Pokemon Center. We continue on. Oh. <laughs> not this way. They really need to put a dead end sign there. We continue on this way. My Pokemon rule, 
Check them out. Youngster Joey would like to battle. Ooh, a matcha. Okay, Taylor has Peck, Focus Energy, and Growl. Let's try Peck. Leer. Okay, I think I'm faster, so we're gonna peck again. Yep, easy. Taylor gained 169 experience. Taylor grew to level 8. Taylor learned quick attack. Ouch, a scrape. I have to put on a bandage. Pisa got 144 Poké Dollars for winning. Very nice. Okay, I want to check out Quick Attack. Quick Attack, 40 damage, 35 damage. Okay, Focus Energy. Focus is power to raise the critical hit ratio. Cool. And growls cutely to reduce the foes attack. Slay. Okay, let's continue on. Trainer tips. If you want to stop a Pokemon from evolving, press the B button while it is trying to evolve. The start of Pokemon will stop. This is called an evolution cancel. I would do that all the time when I play, because I like the idea of having one of every Pokemon. But for this playthrough, I'll, I'll just let them evolve. My bug Pokemon are tough! Let's battle! I'm gonna destroy you, child. Oh, Wormpole, Sag. Let's try Quick Attack. like Taylor so far. Ninety one XP, holy Uninkita. Oh, we've seen one of those before. Heck. Easy. Taylor grew to level 10. Okay, I think searching for the C dot wasted a lot of time. I should have been battling in the harder areas and leveling up faster. I lost! I thought I had you! Pisa got 128 Poké Dollars for winning. Well, yeah, I don't got any heal berries. Should I go back? Hmm. Yeah, I don't want Taylor to die. Oh, I can go buy heals. I forgot. I have money now because I beat the gym.
Oh, my five. And one super. Just so I have it. Oops, I clicked the back button. It's so hard to use this, you know? Another dead end. Won't fall for that trick again. love Taylor. Like the workers, not Taylor Swift. Hello. I study at school and I study on the way home too. <laughs> Nerd. School kid Karen <laughs> would like to battle. Ooh, an unfortunate name. Super effective. Uh oh. Oh, it's not too bad. Taylor gained 124 experience points. Taylor grew to level 11. Man, I really was wasting so much time in Route 102, huh? You defeated school kid, Karen. I'm in shock. I lost? Peace and got 180 polka dollars for winning. I really am a pleb, huh? Abra? Okay. I don't know what spawns here. Oh, uh, what should I do? I don't want to kill it! I really wish I could see the enemy HP count. I'm going back. I, I'm gonna switch to Shroomish. I do not want to kill this Abra. Hilarious. I did that for not. Well, since Shroomish is technically my lowest level Pokemon, I'm gonna make Shroomish my party level, my party leader. Well, <laughs> Abra has left the gym. <laughs> That's the only move Abra has. Really? Wait, are you Bagsy gaming? Okay, so that means if I see an Abra, I should just catch it. I want to get another one. Give me another one. Shit. Ow. 
Abba's like to run off. Just like your father. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know your drama. <laughs> Hi, Titans. Can we get some yo's? You're about to run out of this chat room after that comment. <laughs> I need to calm down. <laughs> well, he does have a suitcase tonight. Uh oh. You know, I can read some of you guys like a fiddle. No, it's play you like a fiddle. You know what I meant. Ron grew to level 11. Give me an Abra. I can play you like a book. Book. Fuck. I've been streaming for too long. <laughs> like today and my whole life. Exclamation quit in chat. Am I naming Pokemon after chatters yet? No, I'm not gonna do that. Because, like, what happens if I name it, like, Kobobo, and then Kobobo is, like, a hate watcher? Then that'd be just awkward. And, like, if I said your guys' name throughout the whole stream, I think you guys would get annoyed a bit, right? Like, if I named a, a Pokemon Mac, that way I'd be like, Oh my god, Mac did a crit! Mac would be like, every time I say the name. So I don't think I'm gonna name my after chatters yet. I'm just, like, looking out for you guys. Because I swear that would annoy you guys if I actually did do that. Oh, I thought that was Team Aqua. It's a dead end up here. I'm bored, so can we battle? With these fists? Youngster Johnson would like to battle. A shroomish? I got one of those too, Ron. Stuns were done. Foe Shroomish is paralyzed. Ooh. I love that. You know what else I love? New followers. Because, guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream. So, if you're new here, click the follow button. Make that heart turn purple. You get cool emotes and you get to type in chat. You've already gotten two followers today. Can we get some more? Wait, the goal's not on screen. We've gotten two followers. Can we get some more? Smile. Okay, now we tackle.
I'm poison? I'm poison? Um... Let's keep him. Look at him upside down. You know, I, I can't turn... I can turn this upside down, but it's kind of hard. Sometimes when I... Sometimes when I tap the screen, it doesn't work. I almost knocked my phone off my desk for that bit. <laughs> it wasn't even that good. <laughs> I try. Wait, he has absorbed too! Uh oh. Um, um. Wait, some of my berries heal. Paralysis? Poisoning! Eat it. Ron was cured of its poisoning. Wait, that counts as a turn? That's not fair. Little does he know, I have a leech seed. It doesn't affect him! <laughs> I really need to learn my types. Okay, at least... Oh, wait. Yeah, at least he only absorbs one HP from me. That is good. I can manage that. Okay, we're just playing Akisak now. Easy. Ron gained 126 XP. Ron grew to level 12. You defeated Youngster Johnson. That was fun even though I lost. Peason got 128 Poké Dollars for winning. If the tunnel doesn't go through, then I'll just go over the top. It also looks like you have an acorn cap on your top. Of his head. Holy... Much HP I got. Ron gained 147 XP. You defeated Hiker Clark. Gasp, gasp. Losing made me tired. <laughs> Peason got a 320 Poké Dollars for winning. <laughs> me when I go upstairs. Oops. Whoa. I'm not saying that. Hacker Devin would like to battle. It's super effective. Ron gained 147 XP. Ron grew to level 13. 
Very nice. Hacker Devin is about to use Geodude. Will I change Pokemon? No. No. Sorry, my button was lagging on my um, GBA. You defeated Hiker Devon. Oh, no contest at all. You got 320 Poké Dollars for winning. Okay, I think. <laughs> okay, I can't go that way yet. I don't have cut. <gasps> oh my God. They're so cute. Um. Um. I don't want to kill her. My Pokemon are too high level. Oh no. Uh, what do I do? You know what? Okay, okay, okay. I will do a Leech Seed. Or, no, no, no. Maybe use Stun Spore and I can paralyze. Stun Spore, Leech Seed. Wild Whismer is paralyzed. It may be unable to move. Just like me on some days. Uproar. They caused an uproar. They're making an uproar, just like the Karens at the mall. Okay, now we're doing Leech Seed. Gradually take their health. Mm hmm. I'm gonna do stun spark because I just don't want to hit him. They're too cute. I could never hurt them. I'm gonna try a Pokeball since it's paralyzed and low HP. I usually wait till they're like have a quarter health, but I don't wanna risk it. Please give me the Whismur! It's so cute! Gotcha! Whismur was caught! I have the perfect name for it. Wee! <laughs> it's gonna be named Wee. We got a whisper! Let's go. Adding that to the list. Please, nobody kill it. Do not kill my Whismur. I'm glad I went back. We continue on. Oh yeah, I do need the cut TM. Let's check out my new Pokemon. Let's see if they can learn. Wrong menu. I Maybe Taylor can learn? Okay, nobody can. How much longer am I gonna stream? Until I get to a good stopping point. I gotta find the guy in the tunnel. I was gonna stop at the gym battle, but then it went straight to a cutscene, so I'd rather just finish out the cutscene. Or the cutscene story sequence. 
Um, I think the correct answer is I stream. The stream ends when I beat the game. I have like 30 hours left. No, wait, three hours since I'm doing a casual playthrough. Hmm, what's going on? I was digging the tunnel without any tools when some goon ordered me out. That tunnel's filled with Pokemon that react badly to, bad, to loud noises. They could cause an uproar. That's why we stopped using heavy equipment for tunneling. I'm worried that the goon can. That's a bad word? <laughs> I'm worried that the goon will do something stupid and startle the Pokemon into an uproar. Well, I caught a whisper. That's kind of helping. Tunneler's Rest House. Oh, there's a lot of things here. That's an oddly shaped hole. There's a small indent in the wall. I'm not gonna say anything. You found an egg special. There's a small indent in the wall. Oh, what am I to do? We were on our walk, Pico and I, when we were jumped by an odd thug. The scoundrel made off with my darling Pico. Oh, Pico. Oh. What am I to do? Oh, it's the same thing. <laughs> okay, I didn't mean to click. I'll save him for you. Surely it's a Trico. And maybe he'll let me keep it. Rust Turf Tunnel. Link in Rustboro and Verdan Turf. The tunnel project has been cancelled. Oh. Okay. Let's go save the Trico. Um, how about, how about we sing Pico in the next episode, because guys, I thought it would just be like a single tunnel, not a whole sub area. So, I think I'm going to pause for today. We're at nearly seven hours. I don't want to push myself. Oh, the music in here is nice, though. Okay, the game is now saved. Okay, pa pause the live splits. Okay, I'm gonna write down the time that I had today. 12, 21, 19.82. We got another six hours in today. <laughs> okay, what did we achieve in this six hours? I caught two Pokemon. I got a Taylo. No, wait, I got a Cascoon. I got three Pokemon. I got a Cascoon, a Taylo, and a Wismer. I got my first badge, as you can see here. I got a badge today, and I didn't lose. And I think I might have overleveled. But you know what? I'll take the dub. So, that was day two of the Peace Love 2024. Thank you for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Holy moly. <laughs> my hair's a mess. It's a mess. Okay, let's close the game. Also, I didn't have to release a Pokemon today. That's kind of a dub. And we got two followers. Very nice. Okay. Guys, I know I said I was going to stream for longer. Peace and light. People did not die. Neither did my Pokemons. <laughs> so, <laughs> let's get some music on. Do, 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 do. Can I save my split? Exit. Oh, it did not save my split by default. Cool. What music should we listen to? Let's do Kirby. So I'll get myself a GPA in blue because that's the one I grew up with. I grew up with the purple one. I got this one from my garage. Okay, guys, I'm gonna wrap up stream here for today. Thank you for watching. Any chatters, lurkers? Thank you for hanging out. I had fun today. Um, stream ends when I beat. Nope. Stream does not. End. Stream is ending. Plan is simple. <laughs>
Tomorrow, Pokemon Nuzlocke Day 3. Thursday, mm, I might stream, I maybe not. I'll think about it. Friday, secret subscriber only stream in the afternoon. Make sure you are a sub and you can watch. How many subs do I have? 57? Man, if you are watching and you're a non-sub, you're very unlucky. I'm sorry. So, and then I might stream Saturday, and then St. Patrick's Day stream on Sunday. So, before I go, if anybody has channel points, you can use your channel We can do a little bit of calligraphy. Do so now. Redeem with your channel points now, and I'll write your name. Or subscribe. If you subscribe now, it will not count towards killing the Pokemon. Let me clarify and reiterate. It does not count. Do we have anybody with their channel points? Anybody? You guys have 20 seconds. Dude, I cannot believe I spent three hours trying to get a C dot and then I killed the C dot. I'm gonna go back and watch that right when I stream. I'm gonna do it. Pokemon colored, so red for blood. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, what are you guys thinking of the Nuzlocke so far? Rate it out of 10. I want to know. And if you say zero, you're in big trouble. I will sing a song. I'll do that first, actually. <laughs> 10 out of 10, it's funny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I will sing a song. Hmm, what song should I sing? Oh, I kind of know what song. I listened to it this morning because I have a playlist of songs that I've sung on stream. And this is one that I haven't sung in a hot minute. I'm not going to tell you what it is. I'm just going to go for it. And you guys are going to pog out of your mind. Yeah, I have to pull the lyrics up on my phone. Okay, I'm gonna sing a song. Thank you for using your channel points. If you want to see my other singing clips, I have a playlist on my YouTube channel. Click the link. Watch them later. I'm not gonna tell you. If you can guess the song, I'll give you a high five. But only to the person who guesses it right. If you could... Put your favorite emotes, your favorite animated emotes in the chat. That'd be great. Gonna fix my collar. Okay. <laughs> Man, it's been so long since I've sung this. I, I sung this song as I was washing dishes this morning. And it's because nobody else was home, so you know I can belt as loud as I like. <clears throat> okay, I need to hold my phone. It's too far away. Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I didn't mean it when I said I didn't love you so. I should have held on that I never should have let you go. I didn't know nothing. I was stupid. I was foolish. I was lying to myself. I couldn't have fathomed I would ever be without your love. Never imagined it. Never imagined I'd be sitting here beside myself Guess I didn't know you, guess I didn't know me But I thought I knew everything I never felt The feeling that I'm feeling now that I don't hear your voice Or have you touch and kiss your lips cause I don't have a choice Or what I wouldn't give to have you lying by my side Right here Cause baby When you left I lost a part of me it's still so hard to believe Come back, baby, please Cause we belong together Who else am I gonna lean on when times get rough? Who's gonna talk to me on the phone till the sun comes up? Who else gonna take your place? There ain't nobody better Oh, baby, baby
who we belong together. There you go. Any guessers? You guys had to have known what that song is. I haven't done it in a while. I did it kind of fast. <clears throat> What's the second verse? Oh, wait. I can't sleep at night when you are on my mind. That was it. Bubba makes on the radio sing to me. If you think you're lonely tonight. Wait a minute, this is too deep, too deep. I gotta change the station, so I turn the dial, trying to catch a break, and then I hear a baby face. Okay, that's the all. This, that's all I know. <clears throat> I only think of you, and it's breaking my heart. I'm trying to keep it together, but I'm falling apart. Okay. That's actually all that I know. I, I can't do the faster part. But thank you, Kim, for redeeming. Thank you. Oh, wait. This is actually the perfect Pokemon color. Does nobody know what that song is? You guys can't be that young. Right? <laughs> um... No idea? No high five for you. I'm not super young, but no idea. Okay, I'm I'm young, but I'm not like a zo I'm technically a zoomer. I'm 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 turning 25 next month. Oh my god, next month. Guys, 12 hour birthday stream next month, unless I have a doctor's appointment, because I might. Hopefully I don't. Happy birthday, thank you. None of you guys know what that song was? You have to be trolling. <clears throat> no? <laughs> what? My eyebrow is twitching. I'm so, like, surprised. It was We Belong Together by Mariah Carey. Was I that bad at it? Bro, you guys need to... Go touch grass. <laughs> this is just a you experience, apparently. Okay, well... How could you not have heard that song? I didn't know the name? Oh, okay. We belong together. Well, I guess it is kind of hard to like fill a song if you don't hear the background music, I guess. I don't listen to Mariah Carey. I don't either. I just like would hear it on the radio when I was a child and like it still clicks. I'm like, oh yeah, I remember that. Okay, we have one more name. Do we have any other redeemers? Anybody else want to stall the stream? Thank you, Vigitant. Have we ever seen your name in Rainbow? If we have, it's been a long time. But thank you for redeeming. Also, I would like to thank you guys for not having me kill any of my Pokemon. Thank you. But also, do not do the strat where you make me kill all my Pokemon at the very end. Please and thank you. But you guys realize, the strat of, like, waiting to merc my Pokemon to the end, I'll have a good amount of Pokemon. Like, that's not the best plan either.
There are pros and cons to both plans. But neither in which is simple. Don't no pay <laughs> Don't! Don't get a budget for the peace and stream. Buy yourself, like, a boba tea or something. I'm, like, joking, not joking whenever I do, like, don't subscribe or please subscribe. It's always a bit. There we go. Do we have any other redeemers? This is your last call. It's so pretty. Thank you. I went to art school and I got a degree. So I can do this for 10 minutes every day. <laughs> Anybody else? Dude, I cannot wait to watch back where I killed my C dot. Actually, I don't want to see it again. But I do. Okay, guys. I'm gonna wrap it up here for today. Thank you all for watching Any Chatters Lurkers. I hope you had fun. Plan is simple. Tomorrow, continuing the peace law. Thursday, possible stream. Maybe not. We'll see. But if I do stream on Thursday, it will be peace law. Friday, subscriber-only stream. I don't know what I want to do yet. Saturday, maybe I'll stream. Sunday, St. Patrick's Day stream. Okay. If you want more peace and content, subscribe to the YouTube channel Weekly Stream Highlights. If you want something to watch right now, go check out the most recent video, which we watched part of on stream during my little lunch break. But if you want to watch the rest of it, it's called I Open Pokemon TCG for the first time ever. Link is also in chat. Seriously, thank you guys for watching. You know, I love yapping, I love gaming, and I love goofing and gaffing with you guys. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys. Bye. Bye, Mac. Bye, Kim. Bye, guys. <laughs> and you know what? I beat a gym today. All on my own. I'm so cool. Also, thank you to the people who fall today. We had Serotonin, and I think they wanted to be called Seri. Yeah, Sero. And then we also had Heart Stamped. Thank you guys both for the follows. Okay, outro song. You guys have one minute. Any final words? Also, congrats to Mac for getting VIP. You finally got it. But do not fret. Mac will lose their badge whenever I beat the game. Which... <laughs> it could be a while.
Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night.